Good morning, good morning. It's been Christmas Day and we're still eating lots of cheese and pies. Good morning, good morning. How are you? Oh, how are you today? My thighs are bigger than thighs. That wasn't work. Thighs, pies. No, thank you, Kim. Apparently that wasn't very good. Good morning, everybody. Are you having a lovely festive time? Are you having a lovely festive time, Mike? Have you had a lovely festive time? Yeah. Are you continuing to feel festive? Yes. Are you? I really, can I just say, Mike, yeah. I love your hair like that. Yay. I really, really, would you like to see Mike's hair, everybody? This is Mike, everybody, who is on uh, cameras for us today. And Mike is sporting his Tintin-inspired hairdo, yes. and I very much appreciate it. I really well, like I it. it. really like it. And I want to know, though, what are you up to? What do you do between Christmas and New Year? For me, this time of year, I'm fed up. And to be honest, come Boxing Day morning, I want the whole, I want the lockdown. I get really, really Christmassy beforehand. I love putting my tree up, but now I want it now. Let's do my head in now. Get it down. It's in the way. I want my house looking clean. Don't you feel you just can't quite get it clean? Anyway, uh, I'm Lucy, everybody. I'm here with you for the next four hours, and I've got Amelia with me, who's our fabulous floor manager. Now, Amelia and I, today, we're in completely matching colour combination. Oh, wait, I'm not. I thought you were more grey. I'm more brown. I'm more grey? Yes. Yeah, well, this is no, this is brown, though, isn't it? We're oh, we're in our black blacks and tanny brownsy Sorry, things. Uh, your eyes are going. Me too, darling. Me too. It's called alcohol infusion of the optic nerve. Uh, and then, <laughs> but without further. Oh, and I've got my gallery girls as well. And by the way, Claire bought Claire, uh, cake in today, and I thought, oh no, I'll be good at work today. Now nah, I've already had half a fruit cake, and that is not an exaggeration. So we've got uh, Kimbo with us, who's producing. Claire is directing, but. This is a very, very exciting day for me because I have not worked with this talent for, I don't even know how long, months. We sort of just seem to be passing in the night, passing in the corner of the studio. It's only the talent of Sammy, everybody. Hello, darling. Hey. Tell us all about your Christmas. Oh, I had a lovely time. I went up to my parents um, with the kids and we all just had a brilliant time. Oh, just so chillaxing. Did. did Father Christmas pay a visit? Yes, he did. And was he and generous? Was just, he was. Made it to the children because I, I just, for me, it's all about that rather oh, than totally. anything. So my husband and I don't often give each other anything at all, but because we spend it all on the children. Yeah. Was it? Yeah. It's just about. It's about them, isn't it? It's really magical. Oh my goodness, so magical. Um, I have to just share a story <laughs> with you before we carry on because our little boy Charlie. I don't know if I've mentioned. I've got a two-year-old called Charlie. Um, it was something happened I would say probably a couple of weeks before Christmas itself where suddenly he got it he totally understood we've done been doing the advent calendar and we've been talk, doing the story of the nativity so he got the real meaning behind Christmas with that respect and then he's really got the father Christmas and he got the magical make-believe and he got all of that and we went to go and see father Christmas a couple of times and on the uh, 23rd we went for breakfast with father Christmas at the garden center oh. and then went to the grotto but did you see, the moment Christmas happened for me is, did you manage to see Father Christmas and his reindeer at 22 minutes past five on, on Christmas Eve? Yeah. It was just, and it happened, and Charlie's little face, he just went, <gasps> Father Christmas, hello! Hello, I'm Charlie, hello! <laughs> and then we went home and we put out the brandy and I think it was Jim Beam honey flavoured actually, and, um, <laughs> and a mince pie and the carrot. And the first thing that he did when he woke up Christmas morning, he was, did Father Christmas eat the pie? Aww. And oh, it's just magical. So anyway, um, do get in contact with us this morning. We would love to hear from you. You can text into six zero treble seven. We want to know what are you up to this week? It's a very odd week. I think this time between Christmas and New Year because it's a time where I'm certainly eating the whole contents of my fridge and drinking all the contents of the booze cup but just because you can because then come January the 1st or we do it January the 2nd in our house uh, it's time to be good so yeah and I'm gonna do a dry January we're gonna do we're gonna do for, uh, for cancer research do uh, yeah, you can choose. I think there's lots of different charities doing it. Right, Kim just going, I'm not doing that. Can I give you a bit of a heads up on what we've got in today's show? We're going to be doing a very, very prestigious, beautiful, beautiful kit. Um, look at this. It's stunning. Absolutely stunning. That is so incredibly delicate and feminine. So, 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 so pretty. 
completely different look. Look at this. This for me is Sammy epitomised in a piece. The wire work that this woman can do, oh my word. She is in my top wire work designers I've ever come across in my whole life. Oh. Oh. So you are just incredible. Absolutely incredible. And then the final, well, not a final piece, but another piece. So these are three separate kits. I'm going to be focusing a little bit more on wire work today as well with this one. I just love how completely the flow of that is. It's just superb in the use of the gemstone as well. But right now, let's do an early bird. I want to see how many of you. Oh, I've got a comment in for Ed. Should that be? A, all right. Um, I want to see how many of you out there watching because we're going to do an early bird special with an extra special twist. So, you know how our findings packs are absolutely essential. You need findings when you're making jewellery. You need your shepherd hooks, your chain, uh, your jump rings, your head pins, your eye pins, your clasps, etc, etc. You do need them. And then there's elements of findings that if you just change the shape of them slightly, it gives you a little bit more of a... Um, Bit more of a designer look quite frankly and a little bit more of a thought out look we'll take a look at these because this is one of the biggest findings offers we've ever 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 done you're going to be getting three meters of chain you're going to be getting oh i'm just dropping everything here uh 90 130 head pins we're going to do everywhere else in the uh, whole of the wide world i think at the moment is in clearance mode we're going to do clearance on this this is a mega 925 sterling silver plated 354 pieces so we're going to be showing them in groupings here there's one group of them there and then a second group coming up just here and it followed by a third collection 0800 644 this is a clearance offer folks massive clearance offer you're going to be getting all three of these you've even got space beads in there crimp beads crimp bead covers in there and the most incredible toggle clasps beautiful beautiful big statement toggle clasp now could I see the call screens, please, Kimbo? Let me see how many people are trusting us already. Good morning, Edwina. Good morning, Lynn. Lots of anonymous shoppers, Chris and Jill and Shane. You're the first ones in my first shoppers this side of Christmas. So CXGC62, I would highly recommend that you take advantage of this offer and maybe even stock yourselves up for 2015. This is going to be on such a low price. Now, I have got people multi-buying there as well. Good morning, Georgina. Again, lots of more anonymous shoppers. Um, you do need to make sure, hello, Patricia, how are you there? You do need to make sure you're checking out your basket. If you haven't yet called up for this, take advantage of the free phone number. And so you've got a few more days extended to your Thursday money-back guarantee because it takes you to the 31st of January. Kim, what are you thinking? Um... How about if we take another five pounds off that? Nineteen ninety-five? No, we're at fourteen ninety-five. Massive clearance price, sale price nineteen ninety-five. Clearance price at fourteen ninety-five. When we're usually looking around nine ninety-five a pack. Oh eight hundred six triple four six triple five. Congratulations and take it away, Rosemary. Well done for getting yours and Patricia and Fiona and Karen, uh, Georgina, uh, Richard, Deborah. Linda, Karen, Heather. Oh, I've got, I've got cousins, Karen and Heather. Uh, Paul, and Paul, who are all brothers and sisters. I've got cousins, Karen, Heather and Paul, who are brothers and sisters. Not fun. Anyway, they're not my cousins that are there because you're all in Sussex and Essex and they're in Oldham. But anyway, great story. <laughs> That's changed your life and rocked your world, hasn't it? Hello, Norma, lovely. It was really important information, life-changing. Look at the huge cacophony of designs and, uh, and different styles that we've got here. Thank you so much for joining me this morning. I had a bit of a nightmare the other day. Well, yeah, I've started having... Do you know, I'm, I know I've been having nightmares. I've been eating cheese like it's coming <laughs> out my ears. It's true. I tell you. Oh, I've got really addicted to this. Oh, what's it called? It's like an orange colour, but then it's got veins in it as well. There's lots of them that are like that. Like it's the, really stinky. The, oh, the, a lot of the blue cheeses are, though. It's blue, but it's orange. Do you know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. So the base colour so of it like, is orange. It's like a double Gloucester, but it's blue. That kind of thing. Do you, you don't... Do you not know much about cheese? You just eat it. That's cool. <laughs> <laughs> I grate a cheddar, and uh, I like Wensleydale cranberry, and then that's about... Cranberry runs well. That's about as far as I, much as I know. I know what Stilton is. 
I think. Maybe I don't. No, Not a brie is. A camembert. Oh, we've got a camembert in the fridge that my when dad sent it. home with us. You need a whip and a chair to go near that one. It's quite, <laughs> it's quite ripe, shall we say. When are you going to have it? I'm not going to have that. I'll let my husband have that one, I think. Put it it's in the really oven with nice crunchy deep bread. deep fried, isn't it? In, in, um, it's really good for your diet, that deep fried camembert. Oh, we're not doing it until the 2nd of January. It's fine. You can eat anything between now and then. With breadcrumbs. Oh, nice. Oh, oh. I tell you what, can you also send in tips for your leftovers? I've made a soup. We've got Christmas Day soup, possibly to last us for another century. It's primarily all the leftover Brussels sprouts, so it's really sprout soup <laughs> with a turkey stock. Um, but yeah, tips for your leftovers. Now, I also want to know, can you freeze chocolate? I have no idea. It never lasts We've long enough for us to Oh, freeze. no, we're inundated with chocolate. I don't think you can. I'm not sure, though. We've got a few boxes that we've given to the Trestle group, which I've told you about before. Um, but no, sort of lots of unopened boxes. Yeah, like, yeah. Well, Half-eaten boxes of chocolates. What can you do with leftover chocolate? Before the 2nd January, maybe we just need to eat it. Eat it before the 2nd of January. So we will be uh, revisiting that if we've got any more of those available later. Hello, Matt, how are you? Did you have a lovely Christmas? You did. Oh, good, good, good. Um, Amelia, could I pass this to you, please? Because I don't think I've got anywhere to put it. Thank you, my darling. What was your best Christmas present, Amelia? Oh, um, can, I, can I say it's an experience? It's flyboarding. You're going flyboarding? Oh, flyboarding. What on earth is flyboarding? Um, you sort of put a jetpack on your back. Oh, my God. You put a jetpack on your back. And then you go flying over the river. And you go flying over a river? That sounds amazing. That sounds horrific. <laughs> Are you excited? And has Leah bought that for yes, you? Yes, she has. It's for both of us to do. So. For both of you to do? Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah, I'll get some good pictures. I'm really excited to see those pictures. Considering I'm terrified of water, that's probably oh. not a good thing for me to do. Right, okay, we're going to look now at these now. Sammy and I were looking at them before um, we came live uh, with the show because they are truly they're truly beautiful. Now, how many of you have got half drilled stones? If you haven't, and you've got single, even if you've got, to be honest, even if you've got full drilled stones, you could use them, couldn't you? Look at these. Now, this is actually considered maybe to be the back, but I would actually possibly use that as the front. And if you turn it around this way, the idea being that you actually put your half drilled stone into that portion there, and then you can even dangle. I mean, you can use that for your cord. So many different ways you can use them. They're beautiful. This really, really reminds me, actually, of the Maori symbol for safety over water, actually. Now you've just been talking about taking a fly pack going over a lake. So you have to actually attach. You're going to fly. You're going to be attaching a pack to your back. Yes, yes. Is that a little bit like Back to the Future hoverboard scenario it could then? Be, yes, I think, I think it's getting there. And then there, there were these sort of um, vacuum pipes that um, the water sort of uh, circulates around you and it pushes you up the momentum of the force. It's really incredible. What? You go about, um, I'd say probably about 10 metres above the river. You go 10 yes. metres above the river and pipes are under your armpits yeah. pumping out water. Pumping out water. <laughs> Why would you choose to do this? I know. It was going to be hilarious. Yeah, right, good. have you got insurance? Um, no, who needs Because it would be That's quite cool. good if you didn't come back injured because we sort of need you. If you can hear that tapping away, that can only mean one thing. Sammy's in. No, do not apologise. I love it. She's in making mode. So, good morning, Jane, Michelle, Mary, Teresa, Susan, and Dawn, Wendy, and Jane. 0800 644 655. So, you're going to get three of these. Now, they are 925 sterling silver. They're very typical of the fish hook, actually. Do you see that? Very, very prominent design. And most people are multiplying these and they are 95 stone silver. I've never seen them before. So what would you typically do with something like this, do you think, Sammy? Oh, I, th I think they'd be half drill pearls. Just sitting, a pearl sitting on there with that silver around it. It's just going to look amazing. It is, isn't it? It's just going to look beautiful. It, it's simple and delicate and small and gorgeous. So, yeah, that's what I'd do with it anyway. Um, I have got an image in, from, in a moment to show to you what on earth Amelia is doing. So I'll just bring these to you, bring the price on screen and then, oh, you are absolutely bonkers. Okay, let's take a look at this. Hello, 6.95. 
<laughs> now, as a silversmith. Okay, that's a really good price. <laughs> yeah. You've got three there for six ninety five. That's really, really, really good. It's amazing, and it's not surprising then. We've got people in Florida buying these from us today. A very good morning wherever you are in the world. Hello, Mary in Warwickshire. Hello, Ali in Leicestershire and Sarah in Essex. And we've got Jamie in Glamorgan, lots of anonymous shoppers in Conway as well coming through. Hello, good morning to you all. So you're going to get three of these. They are 925 sterling silver. We had any text messages in yet, Kim? I want to know if anyone else has been flyboarding. I'm going to show it to you in a moment. You're going to think, what on earth would you want to do that for? KGRF84. No, no one's mentioned they've been. Funny that. I think I actually don't know if it exists. Where are you? Are you going in the UK? Yes, definitely. Yeah, I think it's in Warwickshire. In Warwickshire. Yeah, going, yeah. What time of year? Oh, in a couple of weeks' time, we're going to do it. Yeah. Okay. Now I think that's the thing. In a couple of weeks. What if it's snowing? It could be, couldn't it? I think. I mean, obviously the ice. If, if the whole lake freezes over. If the whole lake fle freezes over, yeah. you won't be doing it. No, be Please tell me you are going to wear like thermal, yes, extra thermal, thermal wetsuits wet and. Suits. I'm going to show, show, show it to you. This, I'll hide all the branding. Oh. Well, did you pick a picture? I don't know which one to pick. This just looks ridiculous. <laughs> Let me just hide that there. What for press now? Oh, I don't know. See, I don't do technology. <laughs> it is worth seeing, I promise you. Right, here we go. Yay. <laughs> Why on earth? Can I show you another one? Why on earth would you choose to do this? Seriously. I'm going to be that good, obviously. Yeah. Oh, I, think it's I do, I think it's amazing. But I think I'm definitely going to. Somewhere warm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So in a lake in Warwickshire. <laughs> you see, I just don't understand how someone wakes up in the morning and goes, I know, I'm going to invent the tubes that you can put under your armpits and go clonking around on the lake. Right, that's Amelia's New Year, everybody. What's everyone else up to for New Year? I've told you my big news for New Year. I'm getting new kitchen worktops. I'm excited. Right. Are you going to get a Labradorite one? <laughs> No. Like, like Rachel. No, I'd love a Labradorite worked up. The whole point is I'm going to go a lot lighter. Okay, in my <laughs> that's not that's very my, light. That's my excitement for New Year, getting a new kitchen worktop. Moonstone, though. <laughs> in my dreams, look. In my dreams. Oh, yeah, if anyone out there would like to buy me a Moonstone workshop, that's fine. <laughs> okay, um, which one are we going to do? We're going to do the number 20. Oh. Right. Big bundle offer, amazing bundle offer. First off, this tool is practically going to be free. In fact, two tools, because you're going to be getting a large and a small awl. So, Sammy, for those people who have never used an awl before, what is it, what do we need it for, why have we got two? It is uh, very, very useful for trying to move, the, if, you try, if you're struggling to get a knot very close to your pearl, when you're hand knotting your pearls, then you'll put the awl in and... Uh, you'll move the all right against the pearl and then gradually tighten the knot and then just keep the pressure on moving it close you know keeping it really really close yeah and then gradually move the all out of the way and the per and the knot should be right by the pearl these are there you go genius 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 um am i right in thinking you can also change the size of the whole of a pearl sometimes with an awl is that one's looking that's slightly a i mean if it's uh if it I know, it's, but that one's looking slightly texturised. Let me get it out of the pack so you can see. You're also going to be getting, look at this humongous reel of a thousand metres of pearl thread and these stunning cherry cultured Baroque pearls, which are a six by five up to nine by six. Now, these are genuine freshwater cultured pearls as well. OK, bear with me a second. Let me just open this up for you. Hang on, hang on, hang on. No, it's just a sheen on it. Apologies. It looked like a texture there for a second. Um, ooh! Ooh, they're ever so... The feel of them's ever so lovely. They're really squidgy slightly. Ooh! Oh! <laughs> so those are your two awls that you're going to be getting, the larger and the smaller. And then you've also got a thousand metres of the pearl threading materials. A thousand metres! 
Now this is designed to go, obviously, specifically through pearls. And not many cords do, just simply due to the nature of the size of a, um, of a hole in a pearl. That's a full 38 centimetres of pearls, and you've got the cherry, deep, 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 deep cherry colour. We've got loads of you flying in for this. Thank you so much for joining us. We will be looking at some of your text messages imminently. Uh, BLGC14, hello Ruth and Deborah, Anika, Linda, Mo and Kirsty, Isabel, lots of anonymous shoppers, and Brenda and Margaret, Fiona, Lorraine, Debbie. Sally, Susan, Marie, and I tell you what, you don't want to even bother thinking about battling with the sales out there. Stay with us here this morning. We've got bargain after bargain after bargain. You can literally gorge, and you certainly don't want to be paying the postage and packaging of other places when you can pay just $2.95 from us here at Jewelry Maker. $9.95 for just the strand of pearls would be amazing. You've got the two tools and a thousand meters of that pearl threading material. Oh, 800, six, double, four, six, double, five. I mean, how much of that thread would you use up to make one pearl necklace? It'd be less than a meter, wouldn't it? Yeah, less, it's usually less than a meter. It depends if you're doing a multi strand or not. Um, you don't use very much at all. I love knotting pearls. It's really therapeutic, it's isn't it? It's amazing. I'll just sit there. I know some of my friends think I'm a bit insane because they don't <laughs> like it, but I just love sitting there knotting pearls. It is a very therapeutic um, and medium I did, to be um, I did do a guide on how to do it and how to start it off and stuff. Where can we find that? Well, I put a link, because I put it on my personal page, but I put a link to it on my guest designer page. So Could we you, maybe do that link again today after the yeah, show, please? Yeah, I can is do that, that okay? again. Yeah, not Thank a problem. Thank you so much. So after the show today, if um, you just give Sammy some time, um, how can people find you on Facebook? The um, JM guest designer Sammy Fletcher. JM guest go. designer Sammy Fletcher. And you'll see, um, if you pop the link on there, that would be great. And then uh, you'll be able to see. So the whole process of actually how to start it off as well, because obviously you need a little bit of excess at the end in order to be able to trap it, to then pop it into your, um, your chosen clasp, whether you want to knot it over or you want to actually uh, trap it in. So very good morning. We are really, really, really busy this morning. Um, I didn't quite know what to say. Yeah, I was going to say, I was having nightmares the other day because I've been eating that much cheese. <laughs> that I came in to work and um, I sat in a chair. No one else was here. So, have you heard of these selfie sticks? Yes. That you attach to your camera and stuff, and then you can take a group shot of everybody. I don't have one, but I've just seen loads of them around. That I had selfie sticks, and I was directing and producing from in here with a row of selfie sticks all attached because no one wanted to work with me, oh. and no one was watching. Oh. That's what happens when you eat an excessive amount of blue cheese. <laughs> I didn't have any crackers though, I love it, just spread on celery. It's a, it's, I'm quite surprised you have like a, an anxiety dream about work, so you've done it for so long, it's quite... I don't think it was about work necessarily, I think it was just the cheese. <laughs> I think it's maybe it was just generally about life, because this is yeah. my life. I had one about it coming here. Did you? Um, I dreamt I turned up late. <laughs> and all of the all of the lights were off, and everybody had gone except for Jenny Cleary, who was stood in the studio with her coat on, and she screamed and shouted at me, ah! which she really <laughs> wouldn't do ever. That is it's so just funny. So, uh, <laughs> what she'd be like? <laughs> Hilarious. She'd just absolutely. She'd probably wet herself. Uh, okay. Right, we are going to challenge Sammy this morning. Challenge. <laughs> Shall I uh, skedaddle over to her? Let's skimoosh and skedaddle uh, over to Sammy. Skimoosh and skedaddle. I quite like that. <laughs> skimoosh. Uh, right. We are going to be looking at some really, really phenomenal gemstones, but I've got to warn you now, we're going to do a clearance price on them and they're likely to sell out now. We usually would revisit a challenge at the end of the show to show you how Sammy had used the products. We're still going to do that, but I don't think there's going to be product to buy because we're about to offer three strands, three premium strands of, oh, amethyst, darling. Oh, how fabulous are these? And they're all absolutely huge whopping ones. Now bear in mind that Amethyst is February's birthday. Yeah. They're just to die for. Aren't they? They are absolutely stunning. You've got pear shapes here going from a 14 by 10 up to a 22 by 12. Now it's a 12 centimetre but I'll count approximately how many you're going to be getting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, okay? Approximately eight on the strand. They are stunning. I'm thinking a big fabulous ring with one of them might be really nice, Sammy. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh that particularly long one. Oh, gorgeous. 
Uh, Kim would also like you to know it's her birthstone, nudge, nudge, wink, wink. Is it? <laughs> <laughs> now the offer that we have on today is phenomenal truly phenomenal these are all brazilian sauce amethyst and the only thing that's happened to them is they haven't been dyed in any way is they've literally just had a little bit of heat applied to them to enhance the natural colors that's there i see these two strands here can just confirm the price again for me doll and how much is this strand usually this is absolutely ludicrous because you'll also be getting these two phenomenal 80 carat strands that go from a 5 by 4 up to a 12 by 5 and they're a 36 centimeter strand two of them one no two cues at gc 5 are you ready are you steady you can use visa mastercard you can use your paypal accounts as well are you ready? Are you ready for this? At 17.95, yes, you're ready, and yes, you're spider. This is incredible quality amethyst. February's birthstone, one of the most, well, it's the major, most major gemstones, the quartz family, of course, as well. Well done, Judith and Catherine for getting two there, and you've got Diane and Margaret, Laura, lots again of anonymous shoppers. So, Sammy, looking at this, I've already heard you banging away. <laughs> what are you thinking you'll be doing with these this morning? Well, obviously now I've got to do a ring as well. But yeah, I was doing. I was just working on a pendant before. No, you absolutely don't have to do a ring at all. <laughs> oh, no, uh, I do. Kim, Kim, what what colour wire do you want your ring to be in? <laughs> Silver, please. Silver. <laughs> <laughs> We're taking this price even lower for you this morning. Ludicrous. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Words fail me. Um, well done, Lena and Carol, Laura and Diane. An amethyst of this caliber, just for, do you know what? Let's get this in perspective. Just have a look. How much would it cost just for one of these stones elsewhere? They're not the clearest of gemstones. They have got inclusions present, but my word to get that carat weight is truly remarkable. This is sensational. Make sure you're not delaying in checking out your baskets. So. Oh my, oh! I'm still working on it, so, uh, but yeah. So I hold this up to the decolletage. It's still very much needing finishing and everything, but there we go. Oh my word. With it being the gemstone of Valentine as well, that is yeah. just and such that's a perfect so, combination. A little, little bit of silver plated wire like that, and you sell it for 20 pounds and you're selling it very cheap, so. There you go. You've paid for the whole lot. But obviously not everybody sells their stuff, but uh, I do, so. Yeah, and how was Christmas for really you in the good. Christmas market? Really good. And up in Manchester? Very cold, but very good. Yeah, because we were right by Media City, so we had people from big um, TV stations coming over, which was really nice. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you didn't get poached, did you? Don't you dare go no, to another TV get, station. No, no, I didn't get You are poached. ours. We, are, <laughs> we don't own Tommy. I did look like a oh. Dalek, though. So I had a, a garlic? A, a Dalek. Oh, they a Dalek. <laughs> I look no. like a garlic. <laughs> Dalek. I had a, a great big black Victorian dress on, and Lovely. I was on a mobility scooter. <laughs> <laughs> loving the image right now it's great. coming through <laughs> <laughs> love it so it was very fruitful for it you it was it was very good fruitful. you yeah. really deserve that i'm glad it was a success for you so 14.95 on these from our professional jewelry maker sammy recommendation should people buy it yeah definitely at that price you can't go wrong can you no especially with like you say valentine's coming up and february coming up and even if you just want you want to make something really pretty for yourself it's so simple when you've got a beautiful stone like yeah. that it really is i think you need to get them quite frankly we've got a little bit of a queue on the phone line so don't worry we know you're there right kim if we have any texts in oh we also need to know your resolutions new year's resolution oh i haven't even thought of that yet think about <laughs> it Think about it, wanting to know, New Year's it's this time of year. So mine is to, I've got quite a few, I've got a list. I'm gonna just try and be in the moment a bit more. Um, I'm going to take time out to do meditation every day. Oh, I'm supposed to do that. Yeah. Put in. No, we'll not go to that. Claire and I went to a very peculiar meditation class together uh, a few weeks ago, and it was truly bizarre, and to the point we got the giggles. So we won't go there again. Um, yeah, I don't think we'll be allowed in. <laughs> <laughs> uh, other New Year's resolutions, certainly to cut down on the amount of chocolate I, uh, I have in my life. Oh, and cut down my caffeine. 
put on my caffeine, yeah. Because 10 cups of tea a day is a bit excessive at the yeah. moment. That's probably what I'm averaging. Mike, what are you going to do? New Year's resolutions. I'll do my driving. Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah, You're going to yeah. pass your driving test in 2015. Yeah, I spoke to Steph about it. She's instructing Yes, me. she is. We've got She's a friend who's a driving instructor. She's going to sort, sort it all out. I'm just uh, getting my licence back soon. So yeah, we'll is she going to be phone. your teacher? Um, yeah, she's going to train me. She's said uh, she's always passed. Yeah, was, yeah, we've got a friend, uh, a mutual friend who's qualifying to be a driving instructor. And as soon as she's qualified, she's going to be teaching Mike. How exciting is that? Watch out, everybody. Right then, so uh, we're going to move along now to the red colour copper wire. OK. Now, there's no denying it. When you look at red, you immediately think there's the connotation of it being very festive. We're coming out of the festive period, therefore we're going to do this a ridiculous clearance prize. And yet, at the same time, red is the connotation of romance and Valentine elements as well. So you certainly can keep that in mind. This type of wire, I would recommend that you put it in a concealed and a sealed container. Um, maybe um, we are going to be getting those anti-tarnish sachets. Sash sorry, little papers in very soon, actually. I would recommend that you bulk buy this and even keep it in mind for next Christmas. I know for a fact some people start making their Christmas things for next year now. I've already bought some Christmas presents for next year. I have. Yeah, no, I have. I have. Yeah, yeah, some perfect presents I've picked up in the sales. Yeah, why not? Why not? If you know you're going to need it at some point, it's a sensical financial decision to make when you're at a really, really low price. Now, these, uh, this is 100 metres of the 0.6 wire, OK? 100 metres of 0.6. Sammy, can I ask you, as one of our professional wire workers, 0.6, for people who've not used a 0.6 before, but people perhaps who are, I mean, and are whether to venture into wire work or not, what would you say about a 0.6? How would you tend to use it? You, you, really good for rosary chains when you're doing linked chains. Um, very good for, which is, sounds, uh, sounds complex, but it's actually quite simple. It's just a lot of it. Um, when you're doing Viking knit, it's good for Viking knit too. That's, that, those are the two main things I use And if you were going to use make shepherd hooks, would you use 0.6 or 0.8 or...? I would probably, because I was just so workable, they'd probably do the 0.8. Oh, OK. But you can do the 0.6 and then use the wire whacker. Yeah, I've tended to use 0.6 yeah. uh, for my earring fine. I suppose it depends on the size of the piercing as well, doesn't and it, really? I mean, my jewellery tends to be quite chunky, so it's probably chunky. what it is. Chunky! Yeah. So with the 0.6, 100 metres, we're going to do an ultra, ultra, ultra clearance price. Now I'm going to warn Sammy that we are going to go below any staff cost um, and uh, staff discount prices. And usually, I know at this point, if I'm sat here and Sammy's not in the studio, I can see her name appearing on screen. <laughs> it's fair to say, I hope you don't uh, take this the wrong way, but you're a little bit of a sucker for our fabulous bargains. Yes, no, I do. No, there are certainly... No, well, it makes sense. Yeah. Because especially when you sell your jewellery as well, because it gives you a bigger profit margin. Yes, definitely. I mean, it, it is my full-time, you know, job. Yeah. Making and selling jewellery and, and working here. Um, so, yeah. What a obviously. fabulous life. I know, isn't it great? Isn't that fabulous? <laughs> it's fabulous. Making and selling jewellery and coming on telly, and that is your, that's your job. Yes. That's amazing. And being a mum. And but being yeah. a mum, so which I is see, the full time. Yeah, <laughs> if I see if I see a bargain, then it's it's obviously very important as a business that I take advantage of that. Yeah. So well, this absolutely one hundred percent is about to be a bargain that falls into that category. We're going to go way below any staff cost, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Previously been nineteen ninety five. Fourteen ninety five would be a bit predictable. Thirteen ninety five would be a bit odd. Twelve ninety five would be really amazing. Eleven ninety five would be phenomenal. So this morning, take advantage, Angela in Dumbarton. Show good morning to you. Ten ninety five. Remembering in mind, our post and packaging isn't done on weight or volume. It's only one post and packaging price for all of your purchases all day. So ten ninety five. Oh eight hundred six double four six double five. Good morning and congratulations. Hello, May Ling. Hello, Michelle and Selena, Avril and Glenda, Pauline and Sweater and Anne and Felicity. Lots of my regulars there. Good morning to you all. How are you? Hello, Hazel. You're back in there and Pauline. It makes sense to bulk buy as well, doesn't it? When it's at ten, it's ten ninety five for hundred meters. Can you let me know of anywhere else on planet Earth that you can get 100 metres of 0.6 colour, 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 ha, or red coloured copper wire, in fact, for 10.95. Free phone number 0800 644 Take advantage. They are amazing. The rosaries that I, 
I've demoed before. Yeah. And they're quite simple and they're just done with five pieces of wire and just around a mandolin it, you make a kind of a rose out of it quite quite quick. Um, you can do those with a 0.6 as well as I do it with a 0.8 but if you use five of the 0.6 it'll work just as well. Have we got any examples of that in the studio at no, all? No I don't think so. We need to get some more of uh, Sammy's examples of work in the studio. Uh, that's going to be a New Year's resolution of mine. Uh, Lavinia and Brenda and Helen, we are really busy this morning, Kimbo. We are busy, busy, busy. So we're wanting to know your New Year's resolution, but also has anyone texted in what to do with your leftover chocolate? Freeze it. You can freeze it. What about if it's got strawberry cream in it? Hi, Lucy and Sammy. I always freeze my chocolate. Chocolate doesn't actually freeze. It just makes it go really hard and makes the bar take longer to eat, too. Mm. Actually, I remember I used to do that when I was doing um, a certain diet that, you know, you go along to and get weighed at and things like that. Um, I used to put my um, curly whirlies, there were other chocolates available, in the freezer. To and make them they, last longer. Yeah, but it's obviously not great for your teeth because they've got toffee in the middle. But it does make them last longer. You have to work right. really hard at eating those. It's good. So surely it then turns into you can a piece of celery when it takes more calories to eat it than it does actually yeah. that you take on board. I, I wish that was true. I I'm don't, sure it I is. I sadly don't think I'm it's sure true. It is. I'm not Gillian McKeith. Where's <laughs> Gillian McKeith gone, by the way? We were talking about this the other day. Oh, she, she had, there was some scandal or other regarding <gasps> her um, doctorate, I believe. Um, do some googling later. I think that's what happened and she just really? disappeared. I think it all came out after she did Celebrity. <gasps> so uh, I can't, I I can't remember this. I can't remember exactly what the scandal was, but there was a big scandal and then she's just kind of disappeared. Right. So there you go. Well, I didn't know <laughs> that. Julie McKeith, if you're out there watching. Ooh. <laughs> right, uh, a New Year's resolution here from Dorothy. New Year's resolution. To try and pace myself better and to meet Sammy when I next travel to Wales. Oh, I like Dorothy. We talk a lot on Facebook. She's really, really, really lovely. Oh, hello, Dorothy. She is. Yeah, pace yourself. Pace yeah. yourself in every aspect of life. I think just, yeah, try and be in the moment of things as well. That's certainly one of mine. If anyone can recommend good meditation books out there just to go, ah. <sighs> Me and Claire would really appreciate it, wouldn't we, Claire? <laughs> yeah. Right, so we are going to go to our very first brand new kit. Now, there is an element. This one here. That one there. That's here. Let me show you first off this stunning and striking piece of jewellery. Wow. Now, I have to warn you at this point that within this kit, there's, oh my word, 40 meters of the bare copper wire. 0 0.6, sorry, 0 0.4, 0 0.6, 0 0.8, and one mil. Now the jewelry you're about to see, all has been made using the kit. And there's actually masses that Sammy hasn't even touched. So you've been able to make this incredibly elegant look and must have beading threads coming out of your ears yeah. and loads of the wire still available but the way that Sammy has been able to encase the labradorite around the pendant is stunning so let's go over and see now you are going to be blown away I think it's fair to say as well if you're just starting out you could probably look and do I want to use the word intimidated yeah possibly mm. actually because there's a real finesse and there's delicate elements to this but over time and practice you'll master it you absolutely will because you've got Sammy at your beck and call because it's fair to say she's brilliant on Facebook if you've got any questions and certainly if you've got any questions throughout the show you can text in but if there's any questions that you have when perhaps you get this kit home you can contact Sammy through the Facebook page and she's brilliant at getting back to you so oh my word let's have a look at this we haven't looked at this one yet the size of the gemstones is the first thing that hits you yes it's a big statement isn't it and it is proportionately balanced with the piece that Sammy has made to accent. Oh my word. Can we take a really good close look at this, please? Oh, wow. 
It's a shame we can't pick up the labradorescence because there's I actually know. loads of it in that in the stone as well as everything else. Let's see if I can get a better angle on it. It's not going to happen, is it? It's not oh, a little bit. You can get a little bit at the top, but there is quite a lot. Yeah, you that. need to trust us that the studio lights are absolutely shocking for labradorite. <laughs> they really are. Okay, bear with me a second. I'm just trying to see what the size is. Why am I being? Yeah, 14 millimetres. Cool. So these are 14 millimetre rounds. Now, guess what they are? Guess what these are? Fluorescent green coated mm. black agate. I know. I would never in a million years have said they were fluorescent green. So if you're blue. watching, yeah, if you're watching on the internet or maybe you're just looking at the description, <coughs> ignore it. That's trosh. <laughs> because they are very much a metallic, like a peacock blue. They are a peacock blue. I mean, I read the description after I'd made the jewellery um, and, and I was quite shocked at the fluorescent yeah. green. <laughs> we'll put a note in our system that these have been labelled incorrectly. I know Martha, for a fact, will be watching upstairs and she'll be able to do that for us. So these are 14 millimetre rounds, there's 450 carats and that's a full 38 centimetre strand. They are stunning, but the base of the gemstone is actually a black agate. They are tremendous. So full 38 centimetre strand. Okay, so then let's take a look. So that's formed the actual structure of the necklace part, but obviously two have also been uh, taken to, to be used in this pendant. Can I just say this kit is flying out already. The, the quality of it is just phenomenal. And take a look at this. Take a look then at this. I'm seeing this is so, you're so right. This has got so much labradorescence in it. This yeah. is really irritating. It's not showing up on screen. Look. <gasps> just about pick it up but it, it's there are there is a lot in it I'm so sorry <laughs> there's loads in it can you just see it when it's flashing oh there's a massive you need to trust us when you get this home because you are going to be getting your very own cabochon of labradorite and then you're going to see can you see the quality of this labradorite all the way around this is amazing do you mind if I show the back of this something no go for it I always make the backs quite neat so well, it's just because then it gives us perhaps a little bit more of an insight into the structure and how these are made. OK, about a third of the sock has already gone. It's going really, really quickly. Once again, you are going to be getting 40 metres of the bare copper wire, 0 0.4, 0 0.6, 0 0.8 and 1 mil. And we'll talk about that in just a moment. Now, you've also been able to make the clasp out of the wire as well. So what gauges of wire have you used at each step of these, please? Um, the clasp is made out of the 1 mil. The, um, the frame is made out of the 1mm and then I've added a little bit 0 0.8 in as well. Um, and then you've got 0 0.6 that's done around the briolette drop at the base. Um, and the double drop pendant is made with the 0 0.8 and the 0 0.4. And I'll show you that there. Yeah. And you can but see then you've got this little beautiful um, blue coated La, uh, agate at the base which is measuring a nine by six on this one here and more like an ocean green yeah yeah and i know i get that love this kit can't wait for the inspiration from sammy it is stunning we've got another one sammy wow 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 so beautiful says emily in the west middle she missed a wow off there emily <laughs> They are absolutely striking, stunning. So once again, the gauges of wire for this piece, the structure. The structure is a one mil on that. You've got 0 0.6 around the briolette on the drop. The 0.4 yeah. is used for any, all of the weaving on that one. Um, yeah, stunning. And, and then I've got used the one mil on the clasp as well. You could use the 0 0.8 on the clasp too. Okay, matter. let's go over to the next one then. So we've seen how the majority of that huge 14 mils have been used. Mm -hmm. Now two of them were taken off and they were used to create this pendant. I must say this is just, I look at this and there's something very oh, Egyptian, ethereal, 
It's the I think it's the combination of the beautiful glow of those um, agate um, with the flow that goes around it, because it's that yeah. mystical colour almost. Yeah, very mystical, almost sort of snake-esque yeah. feel to it. It's got that amazing, smooth, beautiful, it's stunning, it's absolutely stunning. Once again, there's a clasp as well. Now I'm going to show you, just because I've got people chomping at the bit, we'll come to more detail on the designs that have been done here in just a moment. I will show you the, uh, the full contents of the kit once again. So you've got two strands of the agate, you've got the blue and then you've got the fluorescent green which has been labelled incorrectly. It's like a peacock oceanic greeny bluey hue. That was really precise. <laughs> um, and then you've got the full 38 centimetre strand of the, uh, actually sorry, that's a 30 centimetre strand. It's gemstone strands of distinction of labradorite, as well as that amazing cabochon. Now, today we are going to do some incredible offers. That's measuring a 40 by 30. The price for these elements is incredible. We're then throwing in as a bonus gift all of your 50 metres of beading thread, 6 metres of clear elastic, 80 metres of monofilament. But the big wow factor is we're throwing in as a bonus gift all of your bare copper today. Good luck everyone, this is a very, very, very special kit and we're giving away the Bear Copper Wire with this kit today. Twenty-seven ninety-five. Oh, eight hundred six You're looking at under ten pounds per gemstone strand and labradorite cabochon as well, and then all of your threading materials and of course all that bare copper wire. This is stunning. You must have so much wire left. Oh yes, there's loads and loads and loads of wire left. That's going to last you for quite a while. Amazing. It really is. Amazing, amazing, amazing. So, what technique are we going to learn? We're going to have um, a quick, as much as we can get through, of the uh, drop, double drop pendant. Oh, just before you do, Sammy, it's not going quick enough, Kim. We're taking the price even oh. lower. <laughs> like you do. Oh, God, cup of tea. Visa and MasterCard, and of course you can use PayPal. We're at 24 95 0800 644 645 24.95 for the three strands of genuine gemstones, the capuchin, all the bare copper wire, just to get that copper alone. Have you seen the price? The price of copper. This is bare copper wire, this is phenomenal. And all of your threading materials as well. 0800 644 For where you know you can purchase bare copper wire elsewhere, mm -hmm. what do you think of our prices? I think they're really good because you can get it on its own in the website and everything now. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, I think the prices are good now. They are phenomenal. And yes. to be included in a kit with three yes. strands of genuine gemstones and a cabochon. I've never seen these. Um, they've only just started doing these colour coated agate. Okay. They're quite yeah. nice, aren't it's they? A, they're really amazing. Love that mystical. Absolutely amazing, yeah. Tropical. Very different look uh, to anything else that we offer. Mm. Okay, so take it away. Well, for this one, you're going to use the 0.8mm wire. And I've cut off, what's that, about 15 to 20 centimetres? Yeah. Um, and we're going to slide, the first thing you do is slide one, well we'll start off with one bead. So I've just, because the, the drill holes are amazing mm -hmm. on these, so you can slide one bead on to your 0.8. And then take your uh, round nose pliers and then we're going to start just making a swirl at the end. And we'll just, just do that like this. It doesn't have to be that great because what you're going to then do is push it up against the stone and it just sits like that at the bottom. Okay. And that's gonna have it just dangling there. So then you'll slide the next one on. And then you'll, you'll kind of, when you're holding it, there'll be a little gap in between, which is good. So now you need another piece of 0.8. It's up to you how long you do it. I've done another one roughly the same size, maybe a little bit shorter. And I'm gonna hold it with about, about the same length as the uh, gems mm -hmm. uh, hanging over the top there gonna hold it and then we're gonna anchor your weaving wire so you can actually put it down while you anchor the weaving wire and we're gonna go three times around the one that's going through it's up to you which one you want to anchor but I, I tend to do the uh, the one that's going through the gems then pick up your piece of wire again hold it with your two hands like that so it, it's nice um, keep it nice and firm mm -hmm. and then you're gonna start let's see if we can pick this up nicely you're going to go underneath you want to go over the top and when you initially start it'll be a little bit fiddly if you want to push it a bit closer together you can you go all the way around push it up really tight and then all the way around and then back under and over so you're going like an hourglass weave and don't worry if it distorts out of shape because you'll just push it back with your thumb and then we're going to go round again I'll move these out of the way we'll go round again pushing it tight each time. Now the most important thing when you're weaving, I know my thumb is in the way there, 
is neatness. Um, everything, you know, the speed comes with time once you've got the neatness. So you're just going to keep going under and over around each time pushing it up. Uh, looks like, I think it's called the herringbone weave. Mm -hmm. I forget the names of the weaves. And you're going to do this. Can you see how it's uh, sitting like that? So if you yeah. can make sure it's nice and neat. Don't worry about it Literally not being quite up there. Literally just using your nail. Just using up. your nail. If you don't have nails because you chew them right down or they've broken off, etc. Right, you can use your thumb or plectrum. Alice and Terry recommends a plectrum. Oh, what a great so idea. I, d I, I have no experience with this because I haven't actually had that happen. Okay. So, um, yeah, use that. You've always okay. been with nail. Yeah, I know. I'm really fortunate. I know I'm really fortunate. But my nails grow really well. So, but if you are without nail, like Kim, <laughs> try a flexion. But look how quickly I did that. That was really quick. Oh my I, word! I'm such oh a genius. My word. <laughs> no, I didn't. I had it ready already. So when you've got um, a little over an inch and a half, you can go for as long as you want. Depends on how you want to, uh, how long you want the the weave to come down around the stones. Notice that there is a little gap, mm -hmm. and that's so that you can have the wire going between. This is all done with your thumb, so I'm gently tilting back so you can see there's a little bend there. If I hold it sideways, I'm going to use my finger and I'm going to just bend it around and that's your bail. So you're going to then come back across like that and obviously if you weave down further you can have the weave going around further. And then, uh, sorry I should have trimmed that wire off before I did this, you just then just bend the wires around like that. And you have this beautiful flow that goes on. Mm. And then trim them to whatever length. I'm going to get rid of this because that's not really good. Hang in there. Trim them to whatever length you want. Make a little swirl up. Straighten your bail and everything. Just make little swirls. You can do, you don't have to do swirls. You can just make a loop at the end. You can have them sticking out. You can have them floating free. You can do whatever you like. But obviously, if they're closer against the stone, then they are actually going to um, be a little bit more wearable, not catch on your clothes. Okay. But it's entirely, if you want to go for a real flamboyant look and having them have them free and just wear it with a little black dress or something. So that's the beauty of these beautiful agates is because they are such a mystical bright colour, you could wear them with a little black dress and it'd be elegant evening wear and it, it won't actually take you very long once you're getting used to the whole weaving situation it doesn't take you very long at all and then they are quite each one is going to be different as well so. and there you go I'm just gonna hold that up that is so stunning and yeah. okay so we sped it up slightly by preparing by a bit preparing before, but it, yeah that actually wouldn't have taken that much longer than that demo time there it wouldn't it's have amazing. taken too much longer obviously if you're you take your time to get your weaving yeah. neat. Yeah. That's the most But we're not talking thing. about a wire project that would take days. No, we're not talking about a multi you know, a multi layered thing. Yeah. We're not talking about um, masses and masses of elements. So can I a basic, can I give a piece technique. of advice here as somebody who um, is nowhere near as experienced as Sammy but has learnt a lot from Sammy. Um, I would say for me, when you're first starting out doing wire work, do something like that where you can get a sense of achievement in a small time in yeah. a small time frame yeah otherwise you might fall out of love before you've even fallen in love with wire work so starting with something like that where it looks I mean that design is truly beautiful truly truly beautiful and you've seen it broken down not too complex good sense of achievement and yeah I'd start with that one we've got one here from Julie in here we go. Oh. I can always rely on Julie for me for wow, Scarter Dal. What oh. stunning jewellery, Sammy. Wow, 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 wow. Yeah. Merry Christmas to your house, Blackpool. You. How is it, doll? Let me know with the lights. Now, I want to go and see the Blackpool lights this year as well. That needs to be on me on my list. Well, now I know what I'm going to try and do today. That technique looks amazing and relatively easy. That's from Michelle in County Durham. Yeah. It is, and the, this copper wire, using the bare copper wire is so soft. Yeah. So it's really nice to get used to. And you don't have to worry about maybe marking a coating or whatever. You know, sometimes you have to be careful when you're yeah. doing, if you're working with certain wires, you don't have any of those worries. And if you have any copper. dexterity issues as well, this is a great one yes. to go with because it's so malleable. It is. What I will say is if you're learning to weave, go for a heavier gauge. So, you know, start doing this maybe with the one mil. 
Okay. Because you'll distort that. You can see how easy it is because it's malleable to distort. Uh -huh. I so see. don't yeah. panic if it comes out of shape. Just push it back into shape. Really don't panic about it. It's, it's the most important thing is not to get stressed and just enjoy it. I find that if I spent a lot of time doing something, I'll just focus on maybe that one thing I haven't got really, really neat. Yeah. And I get really cross with myself. So I have learned to put it away for two days. I have to put it in a drawer, otherwise I take it all back apart. That's and it doesn't really need good to. Idea. So when you're really focused on something, that that's a normal way to feel. Oh, I don't like it. I don't like it because you've just spent so long just looking yeah. at it. Just don't give in to temptation. Put it away for two days. Come back and have a look at it and think, actually, that's all right. Yeah. Just pop it away yeah. for a couple of days and, yeah. and reassess. Brilliant. Thank you. Now then, I really want. I've got questions. I've got okay. question, question, questions. So for a complete novice out there, for anyone who's watching. What do, this is a rubber block and the hammer with six parts mm -hmm. now I have this and I love it and I love using it but Sammy yes you are a professional here today so <laughs> tell us all about the rubber bench block and the hammer with six parts well the rubber bench block is brilliant because it's it's the same size as the the metal um anvil Our thing steel that block. we that this yeah. that's the one i was looking for <laughs> couldn't get it it's the same size as that so it fits neatly on there and if you're using it with the steel block it's perfect because you have your hand like that and it's at the same level um it also stops it slipping it reduces the amount of noise um when you're so you hammering. can put your steel block on top of this i often i use it you'll see with my anvil a lot and yeah. then I'll, I'll put it on top of there and then i'll hammer onto it um the beauty of having the six heads is you take it with you wherever you go because you've got your um one for trying to avoid marking the wire yeah and you've got various ones for because you can flatten the wire there without marking it too much with you using the nylon head then you've got the brass head to hammer it uh you can get that that will also work hard on it but uh, you can hammer it nice and flat but give a little bit of texture and then you've got the various other heads for um, adding definite texture to it. Can it's I just say that fabulous. we didn't tell Sammy this was coming up and yet you know when you heard her having a little bang away before? That's what she was using. So professional, this is a professional tool at a beginner's price. It's just amazing, amazing, amazing. So like Sammy said, you've got the different textures as well and it couldn't be easier to use because literally the ends screw off and they mm -hmm. screw on again. They do, yeah. You just, just so it's completely interchangeable. It's perfect if perhaps you need to be carrying it around. So, so if you are going to be doing a craft fair, something. Because yeah. quite often as well, you have to park up quite some distance from where you're able to set up. Not at all places you're lucky enough to be able to drive right up there and load the car and go again. So if you've got a bit of a walk or something, you need everything to be as lightweight as possible. And if you want to be able to work whilst you're selling your jewellery, then this is great. But also perfect for taking on a holiday, taking on the beach, if you're going down to Cornwall, if you're popping to Wales. If you're fortunate to be able to go off to a nice, on a nice camping holiday, you don't want to be taking a big chunky hammer, so that is great for that purpose as well. Yeah, I've got them everywhere. So I have, I have a rubber block downstairs um, at my jeweler's bench. Yeah. So I have one down there. Um, and I also have one upstairs when I'm working upstairs. So I do need a third one for the front room. Although my husband's probably rolling his eyes if he's watching me. He's, he's well, do you know what, Sammy? Shall we, shall we make it? He's what, sorry? He's off sick today. Oh, no. What, what's the matter? Has he got man flu? Yeah. So totally, is, it, yeah. is it flu or is it man flu? Love you, honey. But, yeah. <laughs> so sorry. Cop man flu. Cop man flu. Man flu. Um, oh, dreadful thing. Right, you know what? This is flying out already. And at 9 oh, wow. 95 for both, you might as well go for it because, again, any of our guest designers who are watching this morning, we're going below staff cost. Today is a massive clearance opportunity on many, 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 many items. Huge, hugely, hugely competitive anyway. And remember, it's one post and packaging price. This isn't too heavy either. No. This isn't too heavy. If you've got any questions about anything else, on the show today, anything at all, do text in to 60777. So this is a four by four inch rubber block and you've got your six interchangeable heads for your hammer as well. We're heading for a sellout. I'm not surprised. No, I'm not surprised either. It's bonkers. I it's paid bonkers an good. awful lot more for my original one. This is the jewelry maker one, which I love. And my other How one much is exactly roughly the did same. you pay? Can I you can't remember? remember. I think it was towards the £20 mark. Just for the hammer? For the jewellers. It's called a watchmaker's hammer mm. with the interchangeable heads, yeah. But because I thought it was so good, because I, I like to have one constantly in my work bag for when I'm travelling about. So, yeah. 
But 995 is lower is like half price and you get the block as well. Yeah. And remember you've got your extended money back guarantee until the 31st of January. Take advantage. Mike, are you okay? Is your man flu kicking in? <laughs> it's, I don't think it's man flu, I've just got a slight cold. He doesn't think it's man flu, he's got a slight cold. Wow. <laughs> I had man flu on Christmas Day. Man flu. <laughs> Yeah, no, always been a right trooper. So right now, should we go to the Wall of Fame, check out your baskets on that? Let's go. So the final entries for 2014, the final Wall of Fame will be drawn on Wednesday today. It's, it's Monday today. I've, yeah, I've no oh. idea. <laughs> no, I honestly I had no idea what the day of the week. That so happens on. over Christmas. New Year's Eve is then is Wednesday. New Year's Day is Thursday. Friday the second. Yes, I've got things to do on the second. Back in on the third. Right. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. I've no, I haven't got a clue. Christmas gets like that, doesn't it? Yeah. It's just sort of a bit blue. Uh, right then, let's have a look at these beautiful suite of jewellery. Number 226. And this is from Hannah Forsyth in Crew House. Hey, they've got snow. Hey, everyone, Jewellery Maker. Here's my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. All from JM, of course. A red agate from Ten Shum Bundle. I got a bit ago, and I'm saving it for my sister's birthday present. The whole set together is very popping and looks lovely. Please could you wish my sister Deb Shipstone a happy birthday. Happy birthday, Deb. And good luck to everyone who's entered. Love to all from Hannah Forsyth in crew. So to Deb Shipstone, hello, lovely, and a very, very happy birthday. Sweet of joy that's looking sensational so there. 226, isn't it? Just so delicate and feminine. So, and so, so beautiful. Good luck. I know, and then we've got another absolute stunner here. Swooning. 227, Lovely. I adore this, but I'm such a pearl fanatic. Me too. Hi all at JM. Thanks Hi. for all the great deals and entertainment over Christmas. Carol and Mark were hilarious. Attached is this week's entry to the Wall of Fame. Cultured pearls, faceted clear quartz, white crackle quartz and silver findings. Love, Wenders from Sur Sutton in Surrey. That's just absolutely stunning. It is. It just glows. It's gorgeous. Utterly classic, classy, bridal, Downton. It's got it all going on. Well done, hun. Uh, two, two, eight. Oh, oh, I love the way you've displayed that as well. It's amazing. And hi all, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year to everybody. This is from Vanda. Um, this is my entry to the Wall of Fame. I can't remember what the gems are in the bracelet. They were made from a kit many moons ago. And I wanted something special for Christmas, so I had to go at the Tree of Life cuff and team them up with the emerald and ruby for earrings. All the wire and gems from yourselves, and that's Vanda from Darwin. And that's stunning, hun. They are really? beautiful. They stunning combination. It looks like you've got quench crackle quartz in there, lovely. Um, and that's 228. Good luck. It is gorgeous, and these are fabulous. I think they look nice with what I'm wearing today. They actually. would actually. Me brown and black. Um, Classy, gorgeous. <laughs> this is from Jackie, and it says, "Hi all at JM. Here is my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. It's made of smoky quartz rounds and citrine drops with gold-plated findings. All from JM. Hope you like them. No, I love them. They're amazing. Mm. Really, are. really classy and beautiful. And from Jackie Davis. Well done, Jackie, and good luck to you. And the final one for now." Oh, now that's just pretty, isn't it? Isn't oh, it? And if that is the base gemstone, I think it is, which is yeah. the agate with the gold plating on yeah. the outside. 230, this is from Rachel in Darlington. Hello, lovely. Good morning, everyone. Here's my entry for the Wall of Fame. It's been a while since I last entered. I bought the purple agate slabs and I love the look of them. No idea what I would use them for. I happened to catch the lovely Laura Binding doing a designer inspiration with them, and this is my attempt. Thinking of using one as a sun catcher with some fasted amethyst, but that's a project for another day. That sounds lovely. Thanks for keeping me entertained on my days off. Normal TV is so boring lately. Love <laughs> to you all from Rachel in Darlington. Rachel, I agree. Two, three, zero. I was so bored by Christmas TV. I was all excited. I bought the Radio Times. I could have bought TV Quick or. Uh. <laughs> TV R Us. <laughs> uh, other TV magazines available. Had a good flick through it, had my highlighter pen. I was like, there's nothing on. Diddly squat. 
I recorded the Gruffalo, I think that was it. And of course I watched Downton. It was really good, it was really good. Right, take a look though at these. This is, hang on, let me get them all lined up for you. I want them looking their best. Hang on, hang on. I don't think they could look anything but their best, they're beautiful. Oh my word. Oh, they're like a plush velvet gemstone. Aren't they? Perfect Valentine strand there. Yeah. They're going to be a massive sellout. They are Druzy Hearts. Coming up around 12 o'clock. Don't go anywhere. We're going to be doing. Oh my goodness. Oh, check. First off, uh, this is how to buy, but don't go anywhere. I've got something fab in a minute. The fastest way to shop with Jewelry Maker is by going to our website. Just click on the sign up button. Once you've filled in the required details, you can start shopping. You can watch the show by clicking the Watch Live button on the front page. You can also use our Refine tool and narrow down your search. Once you've found an item that you like, just simply click on the Buy Now button and the item will be added to your basket. Don't forget you can add as many items to your basket per day and still only pay one p and Enjoy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that the Jewelry Maker phone number is free from a UK landline? Now you can spend those extra pennies on more shopping. We all know having the right tools for the job is important, so we here at Jewelry Maker have designed a toolkit which includes all your essential pliers for jewelry making, including round nose and flat nose pliers, wire cutters, as well as a bead reamer, snips and tweezers. You've got everything you need for just $9.95. We provide the tools, you provide the skills. Get creative with Jewelry Maker. If you're new to Jewelry Maker, simply contact our call centre and we'll send you a tutorial DVD and get started booklet all free of charge. If you have a question or query for Jewelry Maker, then you can contact our call centre on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Or alternatively, you can email help at jewelrymaker.com. As peace of mind for your Christmas shopping, any purchase you make from now until Christmas can be returned to us until the 31st of January 2015. Get involved with Jewelry Maker by sending the studio a message during our live hours. You can send a text to 60777 and start your message with JM Studio or alternatively go to our website and click on watch the live show, simply type your message into the box and press send. Make sure you stay tuned in case your message is read out. Get interactive with Jewelry Maker. Emeralds. Can I tell you a little story about emeralds? It's not even about emeralds. <laughs> it's just a story. You know the Emerald City in The Wizard of Oz? Yeah. That's what made me think about it. My brother is going to see Wicked in London. He's taking his girlfriend for Christmas, her Christmas present, okay? He's got a girlfriend. Yeah, he's got a girlfriend. Um, no, I know. Oh no. Uh, that's um, Amelia on camera too. I was like, oh, he's got a girlfriend now. Oh no, I know. We were hoping to talk him up, but never mind. Um, they're going to see Wicked. Now, Wicked is the story of the witches before Dorothy landed in Oz, okay? I said to my brother, I said, so do you know what it's about? And he went, no, I don't actually. I don't know it very well, but I'm excited because everyone said it's really good. And I went, well, it's just the story of Dorothy before she lands in Oz. And he went, who? My brother has got to the age of 31, and it turns out, and bearing in mind my musical self that I am, he has never seen The Wizard of Oz. I feel like a terrible sister, and I think, you've never seen The Wizard of Oz. <gasps> Kim's never seen The Wizard of Oz. How can you not have seen The Wizard of Oz? It's like a staple essential that every child should be made to watch. Actually, maybe not child, because it's quite scary. Talking about scary, we were watching, I never realised how terrifying Finding Nemo is until I sat down to watch it with Charlie the other day. 
and he just started to get really like sure because I okay oh the telly's broken now Aww. we'd snuggled in we had a duvet we had a onesie day uh, anyway these are emeralds and already people are buying them without even saying anything about them they are incredible now they're totally and utterly natural emeralds are one of those gemstones that is always going to be in demand they will always forever uh, ruby sapphires diamonds and emeralds are forever ever ever going to be in demand they're going to already always have that um well <sighs> You know that they're sought after. Um, they're also always going to command that high opinion. They're always going to command that high value, that higher perceived value as well. Now, Sammy, when it comes to gemstones that you sell, yep. do you use many emeralds? Yep. Do Not they? like tons, obviously, because they're expensive. But I do. I like to knot them with pearls. So I'll have like a pearl bracelet with a few and then just maybe three emeralds across the front. And so, in so thinking about, that, oh, just three. That sounds lovely. It just is. So you just got cream pearls and then three emeralds. How lovely, because then you could do a series of those with all the different birthstones. Because May's do. birthstone is emeralds. That's beautiful. Yeah, I do them with the, maybe topaz, briolettes and emeralds. And just all sorts of different things, the different colours. Lovely. But they're great. And, but I just... People perceive emeralds as, well, they are a precious stone. They're not a semi-precious mm, stone. Yeah. They're a precious stone. So they kind of say, you're not playing at this. This is for real. That's you know? so true. It's time to take that step oh, gosh. in using genuine, natural Zambian emeralds. I think it's actually quite refreshing to see them without facets on as well. It gives a different dimension to the gemstone. Yeah. Now, in terms of selling your jewellery, Sammy, how do emeralds get received? Oh, well, they're, they're obviously perceived as a very important gift. They're, they're, they say something amazing, don't they? Mm -hmm. So people um, like to know that they've got a real emerald in there. I can't believe they're not heat treated. Nope, they are totally and utterly natural, which would immediately give you the idea, perhaps, of a perceived value of these. Kim, just confirm the clearance price again, hun. These will be, we've got very limited stock, very, very limited stock. There'll be a clearance price. So my advice to you would be to get these today. You've got to take advantage of your extended money back guarantee until the 31st of January. So just a couple more days uh, than your standard 30 day money back guarantee. These are going to be going to a clearance price, so you've got nothing to lose. Now, the only reason we've got a few of these left, because we did have masses of them, is simply if car payments haven't gone through, if people have changed their minds, forgotten to check out baskets, etc. So these have never been out of the building. You are going to be getting premium. Look at the calibre of that depth of green, at the clarity you're receiving. Now, emeralds are known to have jardins, which are their inclusions in them. There's actually very, very few Jardin's presents in here. Now, we've got a lot of you there. We're putting these in your baskets. We are going to a clearance price. So the current price in the system is 40... 47.95 is the current price in the system, okay? We are going to be taking that uh, previous price now down to a clearance and it's on a first come first serve basis today. I do want to just remind you once again that Janet, one of our fabulous designers, who's on the show with us tomorrow actually, recently made a pearl and emerald necklace and my word, she made a profit. Remember, you can get certificates of authenticity to come with your gemstone strands. This is a gemstone strand of distinction that's come directly from Zambia, the emeralds. We're down at 34.95. You've got huge potential to make amazing amazing profit uh, potentially uh, with these here and um, got multi buyers this will be a sellout folks it's clearance price if you want it you need to dial now on 0800 655 and if you want to pop it into your basket you need to check it out immediately so well done Jeanette for just doing yours there Nicola Jane and uh, Anonymous and Debbie uh, shoppers there make sure you're checking out well done to the people buying more than one Visa, MasterCard, PayPal these are premium quality natural Zambian emeralds Good luck, folks. Good luck. I, I can see loads of you putting these in your basket. Check it out. Press that buy now button. Take the plunge. This is starting because they're going to be with you at the start of 2015. What a way to start the brand new year with, oh, I know what I've just received in the post today. A credit card statement. Oh, and my emeralds. Yeah, mum's watching. I'd like, I'd like a strand. <laughs> if your mum's watching. If my mum's watching, grab me a strand. Okay, Sammy would like a strand <laughs> of these, please. If Sammy's mum, what's your mum's name, Sammy? Margaret. Margaret, if you're watching, Sammy's mum, can you grab these, please, for Sammy? Because these are, of course, at a clearance price. They're at a clearance price. Um, congratulations. Now, the, the only annoying thing is, is I've got loads of you with these in your baskets. You're going to have to check your baskets out. And if everyone does, we've almost sold out. 
20 carrots on that. Margaret, if you're watching. Oh, hon. At 34.95, that's a full 18 centimetre strand from bead to bead. Okay, we're going to leave those there. Move on. Make sure you're checking your baskets out. Okay. Um, yeah, I know. Can I just say, oh, I love these so much. I'm so excited to do these. I'm so excited. I love it. I love it. I'd actually use that potentially as a scarf um, for a scarf bail. Put a chiffon scarf through there or something. They're amazing, aren't they? They're absolutely ridiculously fabulous. They're so designer. Ah! Mm. Maybe even alongside those big chunky um, greeny, bluey, peacocky um, agates that we had in the kit. You could frame one, couldn't you? Just hang one in the middle. Oh, yeah. But what works, you know, those uh, mother of pearl cabs we have? Mm -hmm. I think they kind of just sit on there. I think. I think I'm, I'm sure that I had them on the show before. And they, you, you mean, they you were, mean the shell pearl ones? Yeah, the shell pearl cabs. Yes. So you just sit on there. <gasps> and they I look like to a wire up. Yeah, you could wire up things onto them. They're amazing. Oh, they're amazing. They're coming up now. Talking about amazing. Check these out. Amelia, you're drinking a lot of water. Are you dehydrated or are you on a mission to flush your system? Flushing the system. Are you? Already? Yes. Before the 2nd of January? Yes, well, we've got tough mud and coming up, so we've got to do lots of more exercise. What date is that? Uh, it is the 30th of May. 30th of May. Yeah. Loads of the team are doing this tough... Mudder. Mudder Army thing. Obstacles. Basically, it's army obstacles where they look like they're by the end of it they're absolutely frozen and filthy. And yes. yep. it's my. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go and take hot chocolate for when they finish. Yes, oh. I'll be at the finishing line. And a cheese souffle. And a cheese souffle. <laughs> a hot chocolate and a cheese souffle. There's a recipe for nightmares. Um, no, I'm gonna be there. Go, go, and go, team, go, team. Me and Charlie and Drew will stand on the sidelines and watch. God, Right, mm. let's have a look at these 2,400 findings of gold plated copper. Now, this is nine carat yellow gold plated. Check them out. Two thousand one hundred. 2,100 of these findings are nine carat uh, yellow gold plated copper round beads. Now, could I, Amelia, can I, oh no, it's all right, don't, don't worry, don't, I've got it here, I've got it here. Okay, so I know that I've gone on about this before, but industry standard prices would be 100 of these for 4 95 yeah? A hundred of these industry standard prices are about four ninety five for one hundred. We've done this before, haven't we? So what's four ninety five times twenty one? It's about one hundred and three, was it? One hundred and three pounds and ninety five pence. Sammy, have you bought a hundred of these for four ninety five in the past? Anywhere else? Never, never, <laughs> never. As Gemma Crow has. That's where all the story came from. Oh, so yes, industry standard prices are about a hundred for four ninety five. Which is really good. But that would mean this box is a hundred and three pounds and ninety five pence. Now that is bonkers. That's insane, yeah. Yeah. But if you are regularly buying a hundred of these at four ninety five, I suppose you wouldn't really think about it, would you? Because no. it's under a fiver, so that, of course your brain doesn't always kick in. Yeah. So you're like a hundred four ninety five. I'll, I'll go with that, wouldn't you? Yeah, yeah. Well, before you know it, you could have spent one hundred and three pounds and ninety five pence for two thousand one hundred of them. Yeah, when you put it like that. Yeah. That's, um, yes. Yeah. Okay. Yes. So with the deal that we've got today, bearing in mind we're doing clearance prices, you've got two thousand four hundred in total findings. Sorry, two thousand one hundred of them are those beads alone. You got the price of one hundred three pounds and ninety five pence in your head. And that's almost said 93 pants then. 90, <laughs> 95. Right, anyway, shut up, Lucy. Okay, so then you're also going to be getting three, is it three metres from memory? Yep, a uh, hundred centimetres, so three one metre lengths, and they're three by two millimetres on each link on those chains. Now you're also going to be receiving 
your shepherd hooks. I love this style of shepherd hook. It's incredibly elegant, really, really chic and elegant. Bearing in mind that if you're like me and you've got um, an allergy to any lesser metal than gold or silver, the part, the metal that's going to be touching the skin is a nine carat yellow gold, so it's not an issue. Nine carat yellow gold plated shepherd hooks, you're going to get approximately 60 of those. Now, in terms of your toggle clasps, you're going to be getting 30, and they are uh, 19 millimeters on the bar and eight millimeters. Obviously, you get a bonus jump ring in there as well, and you're going to be getting 30 of those. You're also going to be receiving eight of the gold plated copper ribbon ends, which are 12 by four millimeters each. And then, oh, just thrown in there, 200 of the jump rings. You're also going to be receiving the storage boxes that they're all shown in on the show. So, 2,400. Originally, low price offer on this was 39.95. It has been on offer at 32.95 before. But we are going to do the lowest ever price today. We're doing 29.95 and it's a case of fastest come uh fastest so what all of that yeah can't talk. <laughs> hey, I tell you what, 29.95 why don't you bag those up? Why don't you bag up those in packs of 100 and sell them on for 3 pounds back? You could do, could you, you could. You could totally be wow. really, 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 really undercutting loads of the big businesses out there and making a hefty profit and getting the rest of your uh, findings for free. $29.95, I have got 925 sterling silver plated findings coming up for you later in the show as well. But for $29.95, for 2400 uh, oh, just absolutely crazy. Amazing value for money. Flying out once again. How many have we got left there, Kim? Oh, is that all oh, right? We've only got about 40 of these left now. Wow. Final 40 remaining, Visa, MasterCard, and of course, PayPal. Say goodbye to these today. They are coming your way as long as you're jumping on the phone line right now. They look amazing with those um, faceted black things you've got up there. With Wouldn't the gold, they? just faceted black things. There's me the being faceted descriptive. black things. That's why we have Sammy on the show. She's just so articulate. I can't talk today. I'm losing my words. I've, yeah, I've lost them again. Oh. <laughs> we're right pair we are we just start we'll end up hey, just hey, signing hey, hey, hey. and pointing at stuff going that by that yeah just, yeah, yeah. Uh, we've had another text in here thank goodness for jm i've been watching it literally 24 7 12 hours of live show then going onto your youtube and watching old shows such fun from karen oh karen oh. Oh. Um, i've got a favorite show have you got a favorite faux pas yeah, there was talk about whether some faux pas should be in the uh, the Vicky Carr Awards, actually. Yeah, and, uh, probably yeah they were be. last year, weren't they? I think I might have just done a few faux pas in two thousand. Well, people Thank love you. it. Thank you. Yeah, they're repeating my faux pas this year. Good. Oh, people no, love it. No, as in the girls though. are talking about them right now. It's not going to be shown. Oh, okay. No, I swear that I should have actually. Yeah. Should have thought that one through. <laughs> right. Um, now to. Yeah, thank you. Be quiet now, please. I do not need to relive those moments. <laughs> Look, I'm not scripted, OK? Everything you hear is purely out of here. That makes it even worse, doesn't it? Right, let's have a look at these. Because we've just done that amazing findings pack. We've now got 40 toggle class. So you're going to get 20 boxes and two of each design in each one. on camera too with the very fabulous hair could we possibly get even closer on these ah now there you go there's the image we're after you can see you've got some really spectacular wow factor toggle clasps and at the same time you've got some very simple plain necessary functional toggle clasps which are lovely if you want to keep it very simple but also lovely if you then want to do your own thing to them so for example sammy you wire wrap and manipulate toggle clasps don't you a lot i will wire wrap onto them and that's thanks to debbie Balford. actually she was like you really ought to do so, so use them as a base wire wrap onto them. so i did and it just looks amazing so when you've got the really lovely fancy ones like you've got there you can just wire wrap little mm. things into the middle or even if you don't want to do the full wrapping if you just take a bead it's just a simple bit of wire through and holding it to there it looks really elegant and just uh, almost it's like a faux bezel set isn't it completely it looks beautiful yeah. the fact that you've got 20 different designs there 
two of each means you've also got scope of course for matching earrings now also bear in mind that each toggle clasp it comes attached and you need to take that toggle clasp apart so um, if for example I show which one shall I show to you I'll show you any of them um, I think this is one of my let's show you a bit more of an ornate one that you're not used to seeing Oh, you're all right, Kimbo. Kim's just coughing. Don't apologise, darling. Take, accept the medicine, Kim. Accept the medicine. <laughs> okay, can you see you've got a jump ring there? Basically, you take the jump ring off. Because so many people contact us saying they haven't got a clue how to use a toggle clasp because that and seeing it like that that doesn't actually make any sense does it no but no. it's because it comes with a bonus little toggle clasp uh, sorry jump ring to keep it all attached now of course as well for cufflinks they'd be just perfect absolutely perfect so 20 pairs of cufflinks pardon you got 20 pairs of cufflinks you got 20 pa <laughs> you see when you think about it like that as well that's when it starts to go cha ching Pound signs, or yeah. dollar signs, or euro or, signs, or any or other lots of signs. Christmas and birthday presents. Yeah, <laughs> men are notoriously harder to buy for, I think. Yeah, and make for. So these are you've got forty clasps and nine carat yellow gold plated free phone number oh eight hundred six double four six four five. Twenty nine ninety five would be amazing, wouldn't it? Wouldn't it? She's gonna do something. <laughs> Kim just went, here we go. Yeah. <laughs> It's a bargain, it's a bargain. 19.95, right, staff clearance price, uh, staff discount price, all of that. I know I keep going on about it, but it just goes to show that it's going below our expected cost prices on things. This is amazing value. But you know what? I've got guest designers who wish to remain anonymous for buying this at the moment. I don't blame you. Um, but we've got loads and loads and loads of you um, who are getting this. Congratulations, Julie and Jackie and Annette and Margaret and loads of anonymous shoppers. Esther and Judith and Barbara and Brenda, Teresa and Shirley. 19.95 Visa, Mastercard and of course PayPal as well. ZADL59. Now then, your New Year's resolutions. Get them coming in. Come on, come on, come on. Now we are going to do the 925 sterling silver plated version next as well. Oh, 800 Six double five Visa, MasterCard, and PayPal. How does that work then? Yeah, but we've got stock now. Well, then that's silly. So, how many have we got? Sorry, this is going to move. And what's the, so what's the price? Right, it's exactly the same. We're going to do 19.95 on this one. This has been probably one of our most popular matrix boxes we've ever done. It's in the 925 selling silver. 925 selling silver is more common um, practice. Uh, it's more popular than than gold. Here we go. Now we ha I have got a little bit of a queue on the phone lines. I'm so sorry. And don't forget, of course, that this price includes 20 of the little storage parts and the actual big storage box as well. And that's a lot of money's worth just there. Yeah, I love boxes. I do. I'm obsessed with storage solutions and little boxes and little pots. So when I'd used each of them, there'd be a little gemstone going in each one of those. Yes, I like adore it. them. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, yes. So even just for the story, I'll show you the. Uh, there you go. It just literally untwists. Oh, it reminds me of a teles end of a telescope. We got my dad a telescope for Christmas. Oh, fabulous! Yeah, we're all completely obsessed with it now. Well, I used because we used to eight, everything used to come in boxes. We used to do boxes, didn't we, for everything? So I, when I see something in a box now, yeah, I just we've got to get it. Love it. Well, I think lots of people were saying that they had enough storage. Can we stop doing that? Yeah. Well, we're introducing it back again. Yay. Only occasionally. Yeah. Not everything's going to come in a storage box. 1995 0800 Can you believe we're entering into our fifth year at Jewelry Maker? I can't believe I've nearly been here a year. I can't believe you've nearly been here a year. <laughs> e time flies when you're having fun. How long does it take you to get here? What time do you get up? Um, I, I get up at six. It's not too bad. It was minus four. That wasn't was, very nice. Yeah. And I got up before the heating came on, because I actually got up before six, and then went and put the heating on, because there was no call for that kind of behaviour, is there really? 
And uh, yeah, so it doesn't take me long. It takes me about 45 minutes. But Does it know. really? Yeah. Yeah, it t- can take me longer to get home if there's races on because I live by the race course. Yeah. <laughs> it can take me hours. But yeah, it takes me about 45 minutes. Oh, I hadn't realised that. We need to keep you here more often. Uh, right, 1995, how many are we doing on stock levels? How, how, how many? How are we doing, rather? Now, unfortunately, we have got a little bit of a queue on the phone lines. Have we had any more texts in there, Kimbo? No, really quiet on the texts. I want to hear from you guys. I want to hear what was your favourite Christmas present. Favourite Christmas present as well. We've read that one. Oh, that's the only one that's in the system. Um, can I tell you my favourite Christmas present? I got some... Father Christmas is very, very generous. My husband bought myself and my mum um, a voucher for a spa each. And wow. he said we are to go and have the day, just be mother and daughter and go and have a lovely, relaxing day. Oh. So we don't often get to do it because Charlie punts on the scene and my mum looks after Charlie a lot. And so, yeah, we're going to um, go and do a bit of a spa and a shop. Oh, that's Isn't lovely. That bad? It's a really look good. I think that was my favourite present. Yeah, he's a keeper, that one. <laughs> I might marry him. <laughs> Oh, I already did. Oh. <laughs> there is a little bit of a, can I say, there is a, every Christmas I go a bit, oh, I feel a bit deflated because there's no expectation that you're going to be proposed to when you're married. <laughs> I proposed to my husband. Did you? Well, yeah, well, I, well I'm a little bit bossy. You already married though, were no. you? No. No, I'm saying that when you're already married, yeah. you're not going to get proposed to again, it's a bit boring. I got offended for waiting. So he asked me what I wanted. We had been together for quite a long time. He asked me what I wanted for my birthday, and I said a ring and took him in the jewellers. <laughs> Brilliant. But when he, did, he went along with it. That's fine. And when was that? Five years ago. We've you been about, well, nearly six years ago. I've seen your wedding ago. photos. Yeah, we've seen some of them, but yeah, it was lovely. Where was it? Cause it's in it, was in, it was actually around the corner from me because we live, at, we, we live in Presbury in Cheltenham yeah. and there's a local church so we could have walked to the church because it's like it five minutes. Very and then we went to the almost local... Almost Highlandy. Yeah, it was local Highland. pub because we're in the Cotswolds. Yeah. Um, and I say local pub makes it sound a lot worse than it is but it's a beautiful Cotswold pub just around the corner from me so we had it there in the garden. Because it was, it meant a lot. Because it was, you know, it's our little local area. Yeah, lovely. And we just loved it. And we know the guy there, and he just made an absolute perfect day for us. Yeah, so love it, love it, love yeah. it. Well, talking about perfect and fabulous and ridiculous and fabulous and perfect and just fabulous. <laughs> let's have a look at elegant lady. Don't know why I do it like that. <laughs> so. Where do I begin? Sammy. Yeah. <laughs> do you wake up in the morning and just go, ah, oh, I'm going to make jewellery today? <laughs> yes, I do. I love doing it. And oh. cabs, if you give me a cab, I just run away because I, well, not run away, but I run away with it. I love cabs. They're my favourite. And these are amazing because you're going to be getting six cabochons. Six. I'll show you these six cabochons first, actually. And because you're going to be getting two rose quartz, two amethysts, and two fuchsia agates. So the amethysts are both pear cuts. Now these are all completely natural. And these have formed the basis of Sammy's designs for this kit today. Um, so yeah, you're looking at 40 carats on each one, 40 by 30. Oh no, sorry. Uh, one of them's a 40, that's a 40 carat. You can feel the difference. And you can tell that's a 50 carat. So 40 carat and a 50 carat, both 40 by 30 millimetres. That one's a bit thicker. Uh, your future eye gates, you've got a heart shaped one. So cute. Quite nice, actually, with the uh, Druzy eye gates we've got coming up. Yeah. So and these are your future eye gates. The oval is a 50 carat, 40 by 30. And the heart is a 40 carat, 35 millimetre. Then you've got the rose quartz, and with the rose quartz you've got the coin, which is a 30 millimeter, and you've got the pear cabochon, which is a 40 by 30. 50 carats and 30 carats, so six stunning, 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 stunning cabochons. Now you're also going to be receiving this amazing chain, and I know full well. Please, can I request? 
that you show us how you actually have attached this account okay. to this. Um, you can w w use all the demo time in the world, um, but that's a personal cross for me because I know loads of you constantly ask, how do you finish this chain off? Now, you're going to be getting a metre of this. There are approximately two millimetre little rounds on there, and that's a whole complete ball chain a metre long and it's nine carat rose gold plated so it's not just that rose gold colour it's a nine carat rose gold plate and then you're going to be getting again you get the bare copper wire you've got the 0.4 the 0.6 0.8 and the one mil and you're going to be getting 10 metres of each PXGC97 40 meters okay so oh my word let's have a look at the designs am i right in thinking that you might have done a little bit of something something to this yeah wire? i did ah, on well, two, I, I think on two of them i did and two of them i didn't so yeah. so have a look um first off at these two and look at the comparison of the color same color wire but it's not <laughs> so what have you done to the wire? I have patinaed it. And how do you patina? I have used a uh, liver of sulphur. So we'll talk about that a little bit more in just a moment. So that's how you can get that amazing antique hue to it. Um, that, is, that looks just oh so magical and mystical. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. But it, it's so good against the rose quartz if it's that little bit oh. dark, I think. But yeah, look. Oh, look at this. Oh, that is just so beautiful. Remember, Rose Quartz is the gemstone of best friendship as well. Stunning. And then, take a look at this one here. <laughs> so you're going to be getting six cabochons. You're going to be getting six. So Sammy has uh, demonstrated using four of them, and you will be receiving six. Look at that. Yeah, I got the, the banding on it was amazing, oh, and again wow. in, the, in the other one that I've just just been given, the banding is just incredible. So some it, some of them are quite plain, but this is just yeah, just beautiful. That's the beauty of genuine gems, though, isn't it? Every one is going to be slightly different. So. If you've got any questions, please text in. These are stunning designs. You're going to be receiving six cabochons, enough more than enough wire to create these pieces, and more. And a meter of the ball play, uh, the ball chain in nine carat rose gold plate, twenty four ninety five. That's six cabochons, six cabochons. Do you know anywhere that you could get a cabochon for four pounds, and then get all get of your all wire free. and the ball chain for ninety five p? It'd work out. This is amazing value for money. Stunning, stunning, stunning. So, okay. Sammy, tell us all about what you've been up to. I was just going to say, I went to that big craft store. Oh, sorry, we're going lower. Are we? No way, no way. Mm, 19, we're going to 1995 oh for your six gosh. cabochons for all of your bare copper wire and for your uh, meter of the ball chain as well. 1995, bulk buy, stock up. This is a great, yeah. great, great, great purchase. Well, I went to that great big um, craft store that we sometimes go in, and they had a really small piece of rose quartz for 8.95. Are you serious? I, well, that's what I said when I looked at it. I said, are you having a laugh? <laughs> really? I, I mean, 8.95, it was really small. Of course, I'm shocked because I'm, I'm here now, so yeah. I know, but I was just like, wow. But there are many people that don't know about jewelry makers. They wouldn't know, mm. would they? But yeah, it's beautiful rose quartz. Can I, can I put this on? Yeah. So, squeeze it around your wrist. There you go, because mm. it's wire. It's just lovely. Oh, do you, I don't know if I've ever worn a raw copper piece before. That is so extraordinarily malleable. It really, really is. And I use those forming pliers that we've got to make the shape. I love them. Beautiful. Yeah. So, this is a different colour than the bare copper wire. So how yeah. have you done that? I've done, with liver of sulphur, we do the um, XL gel here, um, which I like, I much prefer it to the... Um, it's here. Oh, great. We'll bring that to you <laughs> on screen in just a minute. I much prefer it to the solution that yeah. you get, because I found that the solution, you just can't store it for very long. I, it just kind of all evaporated. And oh, okay. even though I had the lid on it, it was just... So I much prefer the gel. Okay. Easier to use. Um, 
you just put a little bit in the bottom of a big plastic container. You can use a glass container, no, um, but I prefer to use a plastic container. And then use hot water, not boiling out of the kettle, hot out of your hot tap. The warmer the water, the quicker the reaction. So then you drop your piece in it and it will start to change so colour. So do you patina it before or after you've made it? With um, all of the, there are various gemstones you can't patina. Things like op the porous ones, like yeah. opals, pearls, um, things like that. You yeah. shouldn't lava rock, obviously. Um, but and most of them, most of them, you can patina. So if I can patina so you it, made these I'll make pieces. it and then I'll drop it into. Wow! Little... So those rose quartz have been in patina. They have. Wow! The first thing I ever cool. patinaed was sterling silver and ruby. So I thought, well, you know, at the deep end, <laughs> you'd think I'd start with copper, but not me, no. Okay. make my life a bit more dramatic and I was so scared but yes you just drop it in the patina it changes colour and then when you get it back um, when you get it out put it in some a solution of bicarbonate soda or baking powder and yeah. water just stops the stops the reaction yeah and then you can pour that into your liquid solution just to, to, to neutralize the liver sulfur and then you can pour it down the sink um, then put your big container outside because it does have a nice smell to it. <laughs> yeah, that's yes. been polite. Uh, we've got more than um, more in baskets and we have stock available. So it's on a first come first basis. It's going to sell out in the next few minutes. So that's what happened with those two. So what technique are you going to well, show you just, to us? You wanted to sh me to show you about the... I, I egg, really would. Yeah, how just I just, use, just on using yeah. wire. You can use um, feather head pins to do it as well. Okay. Um, so what I'm going to use, because we've got this it's beautifully Is that okay? It's just I know we've had had that request so many times how we finished this off that's okay it's a not point we've got 0.8 bare copper wire yeah um, and I've got about a centimeter laying across I'd, obviously this bit will be as long as you need it yeah but I've got about a centimeter laying across and I'm gonna hold the tail of the wire again about an inch but that's only just for stability because you'll cut that off and then because you can see how malleable this is just go round within the wow within the gaps there yeah. And then we're going to, when we've got that there, if you want to make a clasp at this point, have I got my baling pliers out? Yes, I have. Uh, that's far too long for a bit of a clasp. We're going to go put that around there like this. And you see it's malleable, so when I'm done, what I will then do is I'll hammer it. So I'm going to trim that off. So at the moment it's looking like that, almost like an ear wire. And then you take the smaller bit of your bailing pliers. You can use your round nose pliers, just use the different ends, and you've already got your clasp. And that's securely on there. Okay. So you'll then trim this bit off here and flick it across the studio. Huh. And then you just squidge that down. Take your time to, to squidge that in and make sure that when you run your fingers over it, it's all squidged in. But because it's, uh, because it's within the um, confines of the dents, if you see what I, you know yeah. what I'm trying to say. I'm yeah, yeah, yeah. And on the other side, you would just repeat it, but instead of doing this loop here, you do like a, um, you come out, use the, the largest bit of your bailing pliers, yeah. or use um, a mandrel, like a hammer, anything you want to use as a mandrel, to form a big loop, and then a wrap loop at the other end, and you've made your own clasp using the ball chain. Fabulous. And that, that's really secure, and pulling that really hard and it's not coming off. Fabulous. It's really quite simple. Amazing. Thank you so much. So nineteen ninety five. We've only got four of these left, but we've got loads of you in them in your basket. So I'm so sorry. You lots of you will be unsuccessful. So nineteen ninety five. Right. So the liver of sulfur. Mm -hmm. We've got it here. Now, this always sells out whenever we have it. It's an incredible way. Can you use it on what well, what can you use it on? I suppose. Anything? You can Any use metal? it on silver, copper, it says on the back. Ah. You can use it silver, copper, Silver, leaf. copper, bronze, brass, metal leaf and metal clay. Yeah, I use it a lot on, you'll see if you, if you have got my um, business page and my guest designer page, you'll see that I do a lot of metal clay and I will patina it. Um, it's really useful for that. It's great for wire work because it brings out the definition of your wire so yeah. it will sit in the dark, in the recesses of yeah. the wire and it just gives it a two-tone, like 3D effect. But it's also brilliant for PMC. So if you just have a bit, of, you roll out a bit of clay, put your put your uh, texture on it, cut your little shape out. Drop when you, when you fired it, drop it in the patina, pull it out, polish it up, and then it sits in the recesses, Lovely. and it gives you an entirely different look to your piece. So if you've if you've stamped someone's name in it or anything like that, it will just sit in the stamped bit. 
So you have the bright silver and all the bright copper, and then the dark bit in the recesses where you don't polish. It's amazing. Fab. It does. It, it is incredible stuff. So it's going to be great when you're stamping, isn't it? It's also it's awesome. It, you can work it if you if you get the copper sheet. If you ever watch, if you're lucky when you get Gemma's shows when she has the yeah. copper sheet, it's perfect for stamping with copper sheet. Um, it's just great. Just play with it. It's amazing. Just play. Just play. Mm -hmm. Right, shall we do a ridiculous price then? This is Beadsmith, so it's a well-known brand that you can absolutely trust and rely on. We've tried a lot of different brands, and this mm -hmm. is certainly the one that we found, what well, all of our guest designers said, yeah, the XL gel, a million percent. Yeah, definitely. So here we go. QTBD96, it's 6 95 It's going to last you for ages, because you hardly need any. You don't need very much at all, no. And if you do want more than one of these, we'll take advantage of only one post and packaging price all day. 0800 6 Can I just say something as well um, regarding our delivery? Because I had a question on my presenter page, uh, which is Lucy Nichols presenter. Mm -hmm. If you'd like to like my page, that'd be nice, thanks. Uh, just to say that we, I know there's been a lot of talk in the news about various different delivery companies that have experienced difficulties and backlogs as well. We don't use any of those companies, okay? So um, six ninety five, two ninety five at post and packaging for all of your purchases all day. You could buy a hundred million and one things. I got just thinking about Santa. I got my secret Santa. I ordered one from here. Did you? Yeah. Oh, what did you get in it? I got a strand of emerald chips, but I also got a strand of kyanite pears, and they were like forty pound strand of kyanite pears. <gasps> my secret Santa. I was just like. Oh! Congratulations. Yeah, I think that's my know. best. Let Santa. us know how have you done with the secret Santas if you got them from us here. So yeah. right now though, should we go to uh, should we go to the Wall of Fame? Let's go to the Wall of Fame. Come on. <laughs> So, Wall of Fame entries, a few more here. I don't know why I just did that and jolted myself on my boots. Um, two, three, one. This is so cute. This is from Helen in Liverpool. Morning, all. I was thought I would send in my entry to this week's Wall of Fame. I was watching Carol and Mark on Christmas Day whilst doing some felting. And when oh, I looked God. down, um, what I was doing, I noticed how much it accidentally looked like, accidentally like Santa. <laughs> so, I added some eyes and I took a picture. I hope you like him. Are you serious? Cute. You just accidentally did it. That's so cute. I love it. Merry Christmas, lovely. It says Happy New Year to everyone. Happy New Year to you, lovely. You're Helen in Liverpool. Good luck. Two, three, one. So cute. Oh, these. This is really far up my street. This is two, three, two. Look at this. And this is from Barbara, and it says Happy New Year to all at JM. Thank you for a wonderful year of great presenters, great guest designers, and great deals. My last entry for 2014 are some pearl bracelets, all made from bead scoops, and your lovely findings. Good luck to all in the draw, but I'd really love a win as I spent a fortune this last year. Looking forward to a great 2015 with JM, and that's from Barbara Duffin. Isn't it amazing? I love pearls. I love. I can't believe you got those in the feed scoops. I love the pearls. Amazing. Congratulations, son. I have wow. a new year to you. Two, three, three. Oh, oh look oh. at the technique here. This is from Hamid Hamida. I hope I'm saying. Do you think I've said? name correctly Hamida, Hamida. So. Uh, from Bristol this is my entry to the Wall of Fame after a long time it's a macrame necklace for a friend who is allergic to all sorts of metals even genuine gold or silver rose gold uh, or silver it's a rose quartz pendant and fresh water culture pearls and everything uses from jewelry maker where else and that's from Hamida in Bristol what a great idea yeah I've got a friend who does that with the buttons for clasps because for people who are allergic what a, it's just oh, absolutely yeah, stunning. I can't goodness, believe it. Yeah. That must have taken hours. Two, three, three. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful, beautiful. You must be very proud of yourself. And uh, congratulations to your friend for getting it. Yeah. So you're two, three, three. Good luck. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. So it be her friend now. <laughs> <laughs> this is just a divine. It's like a dinosaur egg. Oh, it is? I love it. It's not actually a dinosaur egg yet. <laughs> no. <laughs> it's two, three, four. And this is from Linda Hastings. It says, happy holidays, dear friends at JM. For this week's entry, I've chosen a necklace made from a strand of big fat amethyst drops which surround a large turquoise nugget in the centre. Mm. I wanted the natural beauty of the stones to stand out. It really does. So I kept things simple and let the colours and textures do the work. Oh. Double strands of lovely amethyst chips complete the look and lead up to the sterling silver clasp in the back. 
The turquoise is from my stash and everything else is from my vast collection of fabulous JM gemstones. And that's from Linda Hastings in Kentucky. In wow. Kentucky. Linda, <laughs> I think that design is just exquisite, especially the double yeah. element of the chips there, your proportions, that has yeah. worked absolutely beautifully. That natural turquoise. I always say natural turquoise looks like a dinosaur egg. It does. It's beautiful though, isn't it? Amazing, amazing. Well, chances are it was forming around, actually it was formed just after the time of dinosaurs. Kyanite's the main one if you want to go, um, no it's not, appetite is the main one you want to go for if you want to go for a really historic gemstone like that. Um, and uh, I love that. Two, three, five, and staying along similar lines of turquoise stones. Actually, I've got a, ah, oh, I've got a strand coming up that's very similar to this. Um, this is from Irene, it said, I made this myself, uh, sorry, I made myself this turquoise and black shell set as it's my birthday in December. Well, of course, it being a one of your birthstones, lovely. That is a beautiful set. You can imagine that on, even with a, fabulous. Even just a simple black dress. I beautiful. Be evening or day wear that. Absolutely. Two, three, five. Gorgeous. And happy birthday to you for yeah, December. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. <laughs> so we're going to go to a short break. We've just got masses. We've got loads. It's a cracking show. And of course, we've got the fabulous Sammy with us. Um, coming up for you at 12 o'clock will be the Drusy. Oh. Mm. They are just extraordinary. Don't go anywhere. They're coming up soon. The Jewellery Maker Wall of Fame is where you get to showcase your skills as a jewellery designer. Each week, one lucky entrant will win £100 credited to their account and the runner-up receives £50. If you want to enter your design, just send a photo to studio at jewelrymaker.com or you can post your photos to Wall of Fame, The Genuine Gemstone Company, Unit 2D, Eagle Road, Moons Moat, Redditch, B989HF. Get making and good luck. The first C we look for is colour. The colour of a gemstone refers to the hue, tone and more importantly, the even saturation of colour within the gemstone. This can make the difference between a poor stone and a highly exquisite gem, being highly sought after by collectors worldwide. Secondly, we look for clarity. Almost all gemstones can contain some type of inclusions formed during crystallisation. Some gemstones, for example emerald, are acceptable with inclusions whilst others are graded on how clean they are. Then we look for carat. Gemstones are always measured in carat weight when cut and commonly in grams as rough. Additionally, there are 100 points in every carat, so every point counts. And last but definitely not least, we come to cut. The cut is the most misunderstood and underestimated of the four C's. The cut should never be confused with the shape of the gemstone. This is the three-dimensional form, whilst the cut is the direct manipulation of the gemstone's facets by the lapidrist. Many factors are involved here, including the vision, experience and expertise of the lapidrist. If accomplished perfectly, a truly exquisite gemstone can be crafted into a work of art. Owning a strand of genuine gemstones is always exciting, but being able to use it in your handcrafted jewellery, then passing it on to its new owner with proof of its authenticity is even more incredible. Why not add one of our printed authenticity cards to your order for just 50p and share that same feeling with your customers? You can also access online authenticity certificates for items you have previously ordered by looking at your order history on your account details. The certificate gives you valuable information about your purchase and is your guarantee of quality and peace of mind from the Genuine Gemstone Company. Amelia, it really does smell. <laughs> Amelia's fiance has made her garlic olives that she's just opened the box of in the studio. Amelia, have you eaten some of the garlic olives now? No, I just, it was just the smell. I just, I, I 
It's certainly very potent in the studio now. I do enjoy it. It three just... Cloves. You've got three cloves of garlic in there that you're going to eat in one day. Oh, I love it. Uh, it's so good for you, though. I love it so It is really good for you, but, wow, it's not very good for the people around you. I've had one cold this year. You've had one cold this year. Yeah, so for your immunity, eat it. It is good for your immunity, yes. Because you don't go anywhere near other people, that's why. <laughs> <laughs> no one with a cold will come anywhere near you. It's basically a little bit like you're trying to keep the devil away. You're keeping people away from you, Amelia. They're not showing their germs. <laughs> you don't understand? <laughs> right then. Let's go on to this collection, which is beyond mega value for money. Now, we are going to seriously... Oh. It's over, yeah, it's on Tammy's desk. Okay. This is an amazing collection. Now, the beauty of this is this finance collection, the hair bands, um, could be used with any of the kits that are in today's show. They could be used alongside, you could put a big, huge cabochon in the center of one of the uh, hair combs. You could use any of the findings with the kit. So it's, this is amazing. So let me show this to you. Now, these are referred to as tiara bands. However, you can totally use them either in positioned like so. So it's a bit more of a tiara. You can, um, <laughs> hey, uh, what's really, really fab, I'm just sat here on TV with this. Oh, very Lady Mary, did you watch Downton? Did you watch Downton Christmas special? Did you? Yeah. And? Did you enjoy it? It was good, wasn't it? I really enjoyed it. So sort of a 1920s feel would be to wear it there without my dodgy fringe. Um, and you can wear it across there. You can obviously wear it on the hair like this. Or if you're doing a bridal piece, it's really great to put it on top of the hair. Now, can I give you some advice? To wire wrap hair combs either side like that, and then it anchors into the hair. Have I taught you something, Sammy? You I'm have. Looking... I hadn't even considered doing that. Well, and I think oh that's goodness, amazing. That's amazing that I've actually taught Sammy something because she's amazing. She's a god. <laughs> so if you wire wrap into there, it gives an anchor point so it doesn't move off the top of the head. That's brilliant. Thanks. I did that because I had to make my friend's tiara for tiara tiara <laughs> earlier on in the year, and it's like that's going to come off her head. So just wire those wrap those on. Now you're going to be getting how. Why don't you try this year for your first bridal commissions if you've never done it before? You're going to be getting... Oh, bear with me a second. Why have I got four here in the silver? Should be five, shouldn't I? Five of the tiara... Oh, it's because it's there. Five of the tiara bands in the silver, five in the rose gold colour, five of the hair combs in the silver colour, and five of the hair combs in the rose gold colour, OK? You're then going to be getting two corresponding matrix boxes the exact same colours, but with some gemstones as well. So in this one here, you're going to be getting some smoky quartz chips. Metre of, uh, I think it's, how long is the chain actually? Bear with me a second. Where's the chain gone? Hang on, I've got a length there. I'm going to have to get it. Oh, it is a metre. A metre of chain. A metre of chain, and they are measuring... The links in the chain are 4 by 2 millimetres. OK, so you get a metre of chain. Now, everything I'm showing to you, you get exactly the same in silver colour as well. You're going to be getting all of your jump rings. Gorgeous little square spacers. I absolutely beyond adore these. How gorgeous are they? How truly gorgeous are those? You can use so many different ways you could use those. These stunning S clamps, which are so substantial. Further shepherd hooks, two pairs of those, and then a lovely toggle clasp. Okay? Now you also get, of course, one of Sammy's favourite elements. You get the storage box. Okay, so this is really, really lovely to have. These are just staple essentials to build up in your stash, aren't they? Okay, yep. so you're going to be getting that one there, packed in. And then you'll get exactly the same again in the silver colour, but with the silver, the gemstones in the silver are... Oh, my word, you're kidding me! 
They're black spinel. They are black spinel. Wowzers. Here puts the value for money up even further. Um, Mike, could you possibly pass me the hair comb that's just on the corner there next to Simon, please? Thank you. Thank you, my darling. Um, so, literally using some of the elements... How stunningly beautiful is this that Sammy's made? Literally using a hair comb, some of the spacer beads, and lots of the spinel, and then some wire. That is just beautiful. Isn't that beautiful? Black and silver is just iconic, isn't it? So, That's so quite, classic, yeah. Quite a simple, quick make, that one. But I thought, I'm just going to use what's in the kit, plus some 0.4. I've just used some 0.4 silver plated wire on that. Um, because beautiful. they're just gorgeous. Now, knowing they're spinel as well. I thought they were, <laughs> I didn't realise they were spinel. Like, um, right, wow, that's amazing. Yeah, now you're thinking, oh, I've got one dropped in the corner of my room. I can <laughs> pick it up after all. Uh, so, free phone number 0800 644 Once again, you're going to be in the two matrix boxes, one in the silver colour with the uh, spinel, one in the rose gold colour with the smoky quartz, five of the tiara bands, five of the hair combs, uh, in the rose gold colour, five the hair bands and five the tiara combs in the silver colour. Now you're going to get a biggest, hugest saving on this today. What an amazing opportunity. So you get an abundance of your findings, all your hair bands and your combs as well. You ready? $17.95 for the lot. <laughs> Forever, that's for everything. I think that would be an amazing price for five tiara bands, five hair combs and one of these. Yep, you're getting two because you're getting the rose gold colour as well. That's amazing. I think because I do, um, I've got clients who have little girls doing ballet, so I do hair pieces for ballet and things like that. Perfect if you've got the rose gold as well as having the silver because you can um, do it with, you know, give it for outfits, matching yeah. outfits and things. It's great. Could you patina onto the hair buns and the tiara? I don't bands? think so because they're coated. Okay. If, it, if your metal's coated, you can't patina it. Okay. Unless you sand it all off, and but I wouldn't recommend uh, trying that. I think that's that. what I've seen being done then, was maybe it was part sanded, so it could be part patinaed. Yeah. To give that effect. Okay, great. 0800 644 655, beautiful collections, 1795. Okay, we're going to move on. Can I just give you a heads up to another one of the kits? that's going to be coming up a little bit later. If I just show this to you, look at the delicate beauty of this bracelet. It is so, 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 so pretty. The proportions of the kit are, I think the best word to say is just truly, it's truly beautiful. Truly, 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 truly feminine. Truly, 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 truly pretty. Because I'm truly, truly in love with you, Do I try and see Lionel Richie again in concert? That's my other question. Do I? Will I be disappointed if I don't? Yeah, I think I would be. I think I'd be yeah. jealous. I I've got the opportunity to, to maybe go. go again. Just go. Yeah, but the thing is, it was so good first time. Is it going to take the edge off if I go again? But are you going to be thinking, I wish I'd gone? If you're going to be thinking, oh, what if, then you should do it. Hmm. What do you think, Amelia? Should what I go? To, I've got the opportunity to maybe go to another Lionel Richie I concert. I want to do it. You, you love him so much. You I do so love him so much. So indulge, yeah. He does bring me a lot of pleasure, so I should indulge. Matt, do you think I should go to another Lionel Richie concert? Yeah. Yeah, in a word. Yeah. <laughs> All right. I might just do that. Oh, 2015 gets better at getting new kitchen work tops and gold seat Lionel Richie. <laughs> <laughs> Rock and roll. I know. And. I'm going, to, I'm going to use my steam mop on a regular basis. My life is going to be complete. <laughs> right, let's take a look at these. Oh, and I've got my new tumble dryer and a washing machine to get kickstarted into the new year. Um, just call me domesticated goddess. It's going to be fabulous. I bought my son a steam mop for Christmas. <laughs> Did you get the one from Equal World? No. Oh, it's fabulous. I didn't see there was one on there. Otherwise yeah, I would they have sold done. it quite quickly. Oh. Yeah. But yeah, I got him. he's been going on for two years about steam mops. He's 14. <laughs> So as a joke, I just bought him one and we wrapped it up and put it under the tree. He had other things as well. I didn't just get him a steam mock. I was going to say, 14 years old, he rocks up black at school. No, he got, a gaming a head he got a gaming headset and all sorts. But the first thing he did when he got home was steam mop everywhere. He's so pleased with it. He's keeping it in his room. Does he perhaps want to come and live at my house for a I bit? Don't know. Yeah, well, you could. You're welcome. <laughs> he just he keeps the steam mop in his bedroom. He keeps I love my son, but it's a little bit... 
What's that? Does he have carpet on the floor? Yeah. Of his it's room? It's a wooden floor. So steam he's got up. a wooden floor, so he wants to steam up the floor. Steam well, up does this everywhere. mean he's now steam mopping your house for you all the time? Yeah. How it's lucky are you? I know. You've trained him well. I know. Oh, now, talking about fabulous things, we've got our early bird. We've got a few of these still remaining. 354 findings. Now, this is at the lowest price we've ever, ever done. It's a spectacular offer. Because it's the equivalent of three packs. Mm -hmm. 14.95 is working out for basically 4.99 a pack. Amazing value for money. We've got images there of some of the uh, packs you're going to be receiving. 14.95. This isn't a you might receive. This is a definitive. This is exactly what you're going to be receiving. Uh, the three packs are slightly different, equating to 354 piece in total. Amelia, I can still smell that garlic. It's amazing. <laughs> wow, it's potent. Oh, wait, hundred six double four. Six to all five. Okay, we have got now mega clearance. <laughs> okay, Amelia, I'm going to have to pass this back over to you, my lovely. Is that all right? What's the matter? Is that right? Kim reckons that on the back of what we're about to do, if there was a prize for who could do the lowest price ever on Crackle Quartz, she'd win. Now, that's a big statement to make because her and Dion are in constant price war. Dion, who is producer, the other morning producer. She's definitely going to win. I've just heard what she's going to do. Right. You're going to be receiving four. Oh, the chip. let's look at them all individually. These are beautiful. Are you, right, you're going to have to be quick off the mark on this. This is beautiful. Look at these. These are four millimetre rounds. It's 40 carats, and you've got a multicolour strand of this quenched crackle quartz. Ah, oh, they're so cute. They've even got a rainbow quoting on them as well. They're absolutely beautiful. They'd be great for soutache. They'd be great just for a simple bracelet. How sweet is that with perhaps one of those toggle clasps on that we had earlier? So, 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 so pretty. Okay. Full 38 centimetre strand. Really? Can I? I've just been told I can cut them up. Could I have a pair of scissors, please, Amelia? Uh huh. Uh -huh. Thank you. Now, look at these. These are little hearts. Thanks, Amelia. Oh, I'm thinking charm bracelet now. I'm thinking mm. charm bracelet, those little um, multicolor, the little four mil, a little bracelet, and then have these as little charms, or just even one of these as a little charm. Yep, or earrings. They're perfect oh, for earrings. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then look at, oh, just, oh. Mm. Gorgeous, perfect for stretchy bracelets. And then these are screaming earrings to me. Mm. Now, you see these right now, and you can see you've got loads of different colours. But for me, when I look at the multicoloured strand, and maybe you're doing exactly the same, maybe you're doing a bit of a Mark Smith, and you're looking at it and you're thinking, well, I could put all of the blue ones there, all the pink ones there, I could put all the peachy ones there, I could put all the green ones there, I could put all the yellow ones there, I could put all the blue ones there, and there's a slightly larger pink, and I could put that there. That's very peridot, I'll put those greens over there. And you start grouping them in terms of colours. And then you have an incredibly, incredibly versatile and very useful collection of genuine gemstones. VIG C98. 0800 Okay, we're going to do something ridiculous. Okay, so. Right, you really, really, really. At the moment, you think you're paying £29.95, is it? And people are buying it. Sorry, £29.80. We've got loads of people that. You're not going to be paying £29.80. You're going to get the lowest price ever. Okay, let me just show you the point I was making. Because I think when you see a multicolour strand, it can be a little bit overwhelming. Oh, there's lots of colour there. But then you see how incredibly versatile. Do you know, can we make a request? Tom, can I make a technical request? Can we get a camera five over this desk, please? Thanks. No, I'm aware it won't happen today. Right, see? See what I mean? These are all genuine gemstones. Yeah? Don't they look different again? Oh, 
I'm quite enjoying this. I'm just going to go ahead with this one. Check out your baskets, folks. Got loads of you with these in your baskets. Oh, therapeutic. Mark Smith would be very proud. <laughs> huh? <laughs> that one's that one's sli two slightly different tones of green, which is really really useful. And slightly different tones of pinks as well. That's that one, you've got like a peach colour. That's a bit more of a Anyone got snow who's watching this morning? We did miss out on the snow here, didn't we? I'd have loved a bit of snow. I'm just Christmas it up. You had a little bit of snow in Sutton Carfield? Really? When? On Boxing Day? Um, no, um, Boxing Day. Yeah, we drove back from um, Yorkshire on Boxing Day and we just, just started coming through some really thick snow as it was coming down and the twins were really excited. By the time we got home it was five degrees in Cheltenham. <laughs> so How we hadn't rubbish. got any there. They were, they were most, most gutted because it was really quite heavy. How old are the twins now? They're six now. Golly. It was a magical Christmas. Oh yeah, I bet. Because of their own, yeah. But yes, it was. I mean, I, if we'd have come any later, if we'd have left any later, we'd have been stuck. I think on the M18 they were having a snowball fight. Really? Yeah, people were stranded, so we were lucky. It's on the M18 as well. Goodness, yeah. anyone out there had experienced any problems with the snow? Let us know. I hope you're all safe. I think it's um, it's probably pretty bad in Macclesfield, Buxton Way, where I used to live. Apparently, Nottingham and she yeah, Sheffield was really bad. I saw the Sheffield part on the news. Right. Uh, I'm nearly there. I'm nearly there. Oh, the. It's gorgeous because it's like a deeper raspberry pink and then your typical mm, baby pink in the raspberry yeah, look pink. at those. There's two different hues of greens. So these are all hearts. Now this is only two of the strands. You've got another two strands here. That's not a gorgeous all genuine Gemstones. It's <laughs> <laughs> an attractive face, isn't it? What's she gonna do? 1995. Oh my word! Get there. <laughs> <laughs> We're looking here. For the, how many of you there confirmed at 30 pounds? Nah. It's okay because you're all paying the same low price at 19.95. No matter when you confirm. Congratulations, Sheila, Kerry, Isabel, Julie, Catherine, Gwyn. Uh, Teresa, Fiona, Tina and Anita. Um, well done, lots of people are multi-buying on this one now. Do check out your baskets as soon as you can. Well done, Sean and Jenny, Ninetta, Margaret, Tracy, Maria, Alison, Kathleen, Rona, Erica, Helen. Lots of anonymous shoppers again. Judith and Anne and Sophia and Brian and Mary. Bridget and Anne. Ah, oh, what a lovely time of the year. Matt, did you have a very lovely Christmas? You did? And have you got any New Year's resolutions? Not yet. Not yet. <laughs> you haven't really thought of any yet. No. Okay, maybe we could make them up for you. Okay, so I think this year you should make it a New Year's resolution that every time you come into the studio you do a cartwheel. <laughs> it's great to it. Can you do a cartwheel? No, neither can I. <laughs> We're quite funny though. Uh, right, I'm going to have to pop these. Um, <laughs> Thanks very much, Kim. Kim just want Lucy. Let's see your chunky toggles. Right. I love these. And um, Kim has got my phone at the ready to order these for me. I are, uh, because they're going to mega clearance price. They're amazing. Even though they're brand new in. Even though they're brand new in today, we're going to go straight to a clearance price because we can. All that profit margin, all that shenanigans don't worry about it just get them because they're great I adore those absolutely adore them so you get three different styles there's one there's two and here's the third you will get a jump ring as well <laughs> we've just taken it off for demonstration purposes now they're huge 
that in there is three centimetres. That's perfect for a, a big, big statement necklace when you have the clasp off to one side, like with those faceted um, agate, are they onyx agate? Those, uh, I haven't beautiful. checked actually. Well, those, with, you know, can you imagine the big pairs and just having a necklace with one of those at the side? Mm. It's just going to look incredibly yeah. high end and just beautiful. <gasps> oh, that is sexy, isn't it? That's yeah. delicious. That's S what? Lovely simple make as well. Like a nice simple make yeah. that looks beautiful. That'll be striking. New Year's Eve esque. Are you doing anything exciting New Year's Eve? No, no, no. <laughs> no we are. We've got are a really you? exciting New Year's Eve. I, um, we are doing my dream New Year's Eve. What are you doing? We're going to put on our onesie, cook a really nice meal. Me and Drew are going to snuggle up on the sofa and watch a movie with a duvet. Oh, that's pretty much what we're doing. I'm so excited. Oh, my God. I'm so excited. It is lovely, though, isn't it? Just to curl up. We never get a chance to do nothing. No. We're going to do nothing. Yeah. Right, 0800 644 605 B bars. B A A Z60. So we'll come to those amazing plastic black gems so shortly. Um, you're going to be getting three of these phenomenal chunky uh, clasps. So the three centimetres by approximately, ah, bear with me a second. We've got one T-bar clasp here. This T-bar clasp here, the clasp is 40 millimetres and that's 29 millimetres in diameter. Then this one is 50 millimetres in diameter and 30 millimetres in diameter there. And this one is 57 millimetres and 34 millimetres. 0800 644 655 For all three... Oh my word! Oh my word! Oh my word! Buy them, 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 and a bit more buy them. Just get them! That's amazing! That is absolutely astonishing. I was not expecting that. No. I was not expecting that. Oh, they're fabulous. Oh, I get a couple of those. Oh, yeah, treat yourself to those. Happy New Year. Boom. Boom. Shake, shake the room. Tick, <laughs> tick, tick, tick. Boom. <laughs> oh, well, yeah. You know, so a solution. Don't be such a geek. <laughs> oh, I'm loving the idea of an asymmetric necklace, like you just said. Yeah. It just stands out. You don't see them very often, do you? Mm, no. So it's something a little bit different. No, I've never presented anything like this on the channel before. What are you doing New Year's Eve, Mike? I'm not sure yet. You're not sure yet? No, well, a few things up in the air, but... Yeah, we've been invited to many parties, but we've declined <laughs> all of them. Um, now we just decide we're having a duvet oh. night with, yeah, nice food. I'd invite you around, Mike, but it'd be a bit inappropriate. No, um, Amelia, what are you doing New Year's <laughs> Eve? I'm going to the Lawn Farmer Social Club with Sir Burlesque. You're going to a burlesque club? Yes, and in oh. the top 10 things to do on New Year's in the UK. And, and it's in the top 10 things to do in the UK on New Year's Eve. Burlesque do you know what? Club. This woman leads the most ridiculous, fabulous life. She's going, she's going flying with pipes up her armpits or something. <laughs> <laughs> in water in, yeah. later on. She ought to do that in burlesque wear. <laughs> you, do, hey, uh, right then. Yes. And you could make certain parts of it beaded, couldn't you? You could do. Yeah. Right, Marvellous. Kim, what are you doing New Year's Eve? You're going out in town. Have you got tickets for anywhere yet? Are you going to be freezing cold waiting to get in? You're going to wing it. Are you bonkers? Uh -oh. um, Tom, what are you doing? You're winging it as well. Oh, to be young and young. <laughs> young and child free. Yeah. <laughs> right, 0800. Six double four, six double five, B A A Z six zero. Oh, now then. Oh, lush, lush, luscious, luscious, lush, luscious, lusciousness. I adore these. Now, one of my New Year's resolutions is to get a little bit more organised, and I actually quite like getting these to organise not just my jewellery, but other things that I want to put in my suitcase when I'm going on holiday or when I'm going away because sometimes it just gets all a little bit chaotic in my suitcase um, but the, just to keep big beautiful necklaces in hair accessories in I put hair grips in one that sort of thing but these how beautiful are these velvet bags look Sammy they're gorgeous 
Okay, you're gonna get five of them. The largest is 22 by 17 centimeters, okay? Okay, they're stunning. Oh, you see, I think even for Christmas presents next year, we're gonna do a clearance price on them. XD GP19. I bought my Christmas wrapping paper, I bought my Christmas crackers. Oh, hey, I went to a high street department store, 65% off Christmas crackers. I was really excited. <laughs> I'm gonna get some more on the way home. Bit of a shopaholic. Uh, so, oh, can I get the uh, can I get the sizes up again, please, Kim? So the next size down is nineteen by fifteen. This is twelve by sixteen. This is twelve by ten, and this one is nine by seven. So these are beautiful velvet bags. Now obviously you can then personalise them, you could embroider onto them, you could put a little tag on the side of them if you want this to be for your business. They're beautiful, they're really classy, they're the type of thing that will set you apart from other jewellery makers if you'll sell your jewellery, if you can pop it in something like this. And they're just a look, do you know what I'd be tempted to do? I'd be tempted to possibly use that size could even put some of the big chunky chain on it and use that as a bag. Could do. I just think they'd be perfect for gifts, Valentine's Day, yeah. anything like that. Um, yeah, just I mean, if you're going to make a lovely pearl necklace and you just want to put it in a beautiful velvet pouch and give it to somebody, what a gorgeous gift. Gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Free phone number 0800 655. Are you ready? Oh my word! Six ninety-five. Oh my word! Where could you even find one of this size for six ninety-five? Oh, and do you know what? They just feel scrummy. You are getting one, two, three, four, five for those beautiful velvet bags. And even you know what? Even if you're selling your jewellery as well, um, to use it for putting your money in your petty cash and things. You know, make yourself a little bag out of it. Oh, you could do that, couldn't you? That'd look really like, it'd look well classy. Uh, XD GP19. Yeah, they're going really, really quickly. So, um, got a few of those remaining. Visa, MasterCard, and your PayPal accounts as well can be used here at Jewelry Maker. Spend your Christmas spends. Who got a voucher? Oh, did you get a voucher? Where for, Claire? Yeah. You got one for Jack Wills, one for Debenhams. And one for Amazon. Check you out in your little Miss Money Penny. Did you get any vouchers, Mike? Yeah, I got uh, iTunes and a Spotify. An iTunes one and a Spotify one. Yeah. And another Amazon one as well. Did you get any vouchers? I got Amazon ones. Amazon, I'll check you all out. Did you get any vouchers this year? No. Oh, yeah, because if you yeah, if it's a voucher, it's free. What is? free money, so to speak. But it doesn't feel, yeah, it feels like you're allowed to indulge, doesn't it, if it's a voucher? Yeah, it does. <laughs> is it adjustable in size? That it is. So even though the fact you've made it for Kim, I can have it. <laughs> <gasps> Kim! Oh my word, Kim. Oh my word, Kim. <laughs> oh. <gasps> Shall I show you Kim's um, ring? <laughs> she, Did you hear that? No, I didn't. Oh, yeah, I love it. <laughs> She's just said, that's so me. <laughs> Kim? She's saying she's even wearing an amethyst ring today and it'll totally match. Oh, that's really good. I'm so pleased she liked oh, it. Oh, that is, Sammy, that is amazing. Look at this, folks. This is using part of the challenge in inverted <laughs> Oh. <gasps> Sammy, can I ask how much, what, if you were to sell this, would you make it in silver plate or 925? Um, I do both. Okay. Uh, 30 pounds for the plate and 50 to 60 pounds for the uh, sterling, sometimes more for the sterling. Sometimes, it depends on the stone, you see. For that one, it would be 30 pounds. It's beautiful. 
Everyone's ki- yeah, okay, Kim, don't worry. Kim's just going, don't let me forget it. Don't let me forget it. I can't <laughs> leave that here. Don't let me forget it. Don't worry. That is beautiful. Oh, it's ridiculous. I love her. Um, right, I'll pop it there, okay? Because we'll be looking at it for the challenge anyway. I won't let you forget it because I want you to. Well, come here then. <laughs> I'm not going in there. I've got the pregnant costume on. Have you noticed Kim will only ever come on screen when she's looking ridiculous? Um, there you are, Mike. No, thank you, darling. Okay, where should we go to next? Where should we go to next, sorry, doll? She's too occupied with uh, getting that. <laughs> the cord bundle. Is, did you just say, hello? Yeah, the cord bundle. She's like, oh, the ring, the ring. Producer, she's just producing live telly. Now then, we are looking here at these weaving cord uh, selection. And it is an amazing, amazing type of cord. And uh, let me just confirm for you. Yeah, you're going to be getting two of the um, golden yellow, two of the magenta, two of the royal blue, two of the silver, and two, sorry, I said uh, of the bright red. So bright red, this is the magenta here. Now, this is weaving cord, and to say that it's versatile is probably one of the biggest understatements of the century. You can actually make your own paracord bracelets out of this as well. Have you used any of this cord before, Sammy? Um, yeah, I think I have actually, because I do a lot of Kumihimo, so I would have used it for that. Yeah. And um, last night I was doing macrame, would you believe? And? Um, did you enjoy it? I did, yes. I can't talk too much about it. It's a commission that it hasn't, uh, she hasn't given it to. It, I had to do a matching pendant for her and a bracelet for him. So I nice. wire wrapped it and then with a macrame band. But yeah, I can't say any more than that because okay. it's not got don't there disclose, yet. Don't disclose, don't disclose. Yes, I do. I mean, I love that when you've got a, a collection like that, you can use them together or separately mm. and you can do them with so many different coloured wires and stones. It's just... Brilliant. See, for me, initially, that with the blue from the first kit that we had, the blue gemstones, would be... Ah, do you know what? You've just made me crave going to Cheltenham. I bet the shopping's really good now it with is. all the sales on. Have you been in? Um, no, not, to, not in the... I went... Well, I've been to the outskirts, not actually in. Because I'm on the scooter. You're kind of invisible, I think, on a scooter. So I think like that is a, just completely. Oh, don't get me, don't even get me started. Yeah. So they'll come if you're waiting to look at something because you've got a bulky scooter and you can't get in. People are just going to stand in front of you. So if you're, you know, you're just trying to wait to get in there and then they'll. Wondering just walk in if front we could create something that's potentially dangerous. So I shouldn't probably. Suggest <laughs> no I'm thinking plow if you spikes. work hard in 1.5 wire <laughs> and basically create spikes all around you. Well, I do. You know, I do Whitby Goth and steampunk yeah. weekends, and I'm going back there in April. And there's a guy who's completely steampunked up a big mobility scooter. He's got a rocket launcher on the front. I don't think it works. But, you know, there's the temptation's there, yeah. definitely. Yeah. Surely you could do it interchangeable, so it's, it doesn't have to be a permanent fixture, then it's interchangeable, yeah, for yeah. different appropriate occasions. But certainly, I think you need to almost have going to battle if you're going shopping and people... Just don't even get me started on it. same with a pushchair, isn't it? It's the oh. same. Same with the push chair. Totally, totally, yeah. So, RXGP43, <laughs> but a friend of mine as well, Ruth, who's one of the presenters, she's broken her, rip, her hip oh. recently. Um, and it's the same, and she's on blatantly on crutches. Some people are just downright rude. I saw Ruth yeah. the other day in Stratford. You saw Ruth the other day in Stratford? We were on a night out with my friends, and uh, she was with Joe. Oh, uh, yes, you did go out for this show. Do you know what? We're having all these fantastic conversations, and yet we're doing a clearance <laughs> price on these. So you're going to get 10 lots, and you've got 10 metres on each, so you're going to be getting 100 metres in total. You've got that deep, beautiful blue, and it's 6 95 for all of these. It's amazing. I've got to say as well, this is incredibly strong. You can put a heck of a weight on it, which is why it's brilliant for paracords as well. Good morning, ladies. Great deals today. What does the cord feel like? Because it looks very silky. Hayley, let me tell you. Um, it feels... It doesn't feel slippy. It feels silky, but it's got a texture that would mean that it's going to grip itself really well when it knots. Does that make sense? Mm. 
So it feels, yes, it's it's got a very smooth, it's smooth, it's not silky, slidey. It's not like the satin cord. Does that help, Hayley? Can you let me know? So it's got the texture where you know. So if you run your hand that way along it, you can feel the texture of it a little bit more. You know that it's going to hold a knot really well. That like seven p a meter. Pardon? Is that like seven p a meter? Yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah, it's seven p a meter. So you could potentially buy that, and if you didn't want all the colours, you could sell the other ones off. Yeah. <laughs> and do you think that you could perhaps, even if you sell them for ten p a meter, you'd be in profit? Wouldn't you? Yeah. But you've got so much. You can do beautiful, lovely friendship bracelets and everything in all different colours and all different colour combinations. That's a really good deal, isn't it? It's, it's phenomenal. A good deal. 0800 655. Do you always do them when I'm here, Kim? Not when Kim. I'm watching at home. It's not fair. Well, you do them when I'm watching as well. But yeah, I was going to say, Sammy, you do appear on the here. screen quite frequently. Yeah, I know. Yeah, but it, it's your business. It, so it makes sense business. for you to buy yes. the deals. Yes. Yeah. Definitely. 0800 644 RX GP43. Right, we're going to go to our final kit of the show. And I think the silver would work really nicely with it. Um, I have been giving you a little bit of a heads up on this kit because we've got a very, very different look. This one doesn't use wire at all. Yeah. So this one is very much about um, a very pretty, delicate, dainty look. Sorry, I just got distracted there because we've got Jackson and Kayla are up there with Laura Binding, her two children are here. Uh, hello, you gorgeous little human beings. Make sure you come down. Yeah, uh, Laura Binding is obviously, she might have just popped in for a visit, but I think that means that she's here for the designer inspiration she this is. afternoon. And uh, she's got the kitty wings with her. I, Laura Binding's got a big announcement to make. Ooh. No, she's not pregnant. <laughs> I know that everybody's <laughs> announcement so far seems to be that. Uh, no, it's just Carol who is having a baby. We're really excited. Uh, the rest of us are just getting drunk. <laughs> <laughs> but Laura Binding has achieved a lifetime achievement. She passed the driving test. I'm so proud of her. She did it on Christmas Eve. I know. What a good day to do it. Yeah, but how rubbish would it have been if she'd have failed? Who chooses to take the driving test on Christmas Eve? Um, right. Oh, my word. Sammy, you have used this kit. Just. Oh, it's honestly. Look. Goosebumps. Aww. It's beautiful. It's simply elegant, divine, the proportions and really take note on how Sammy has done this. And I would advise it, perhaps even if you're starting off, copy it, bead for bead, literally copy every single element. From the delicate, beautifully little, dainty, faceted um, little quartz. Bear with me a second, because I haven't got my... Um, I haven't got my gemstone details there. Could I just grab those? Thank you, my lovely. So you've got the little clear faceted quartz. Just to know that you've got 94 facets on each wow. of those little quartz, all by hand. Wow. And there must be over 50 beads on there, on they, each one. I'll count them up in a minute. Lovely, and they go for miles. I've still got quite a bit left. Have you? Yeah, I've put it underneath, so it's not very useful to you, is it? But yes, I've still got quite a bit left. They are really nice. Beautiful. Just bear with me a second. Okay, so the clear quartz. Oh, bear with me. I'm being given the information, but it's about as big as a mouse could read. <laughs> if a mouse has really good eyesight. <laughs> okay, they're three millimeter rounds on the clear quartz faceted, they're natural and they're from Brazil and they're 25 carats, okay? So that strand here. Now this seems to have gone a really, really long way as well because it's been incorporated in the next bracelet as well with two strands of genuine freshwater culture pearls. With the next one as well, with the little amethyst and the freshwater culture pearls as well. And then really creates this amazing, makes you salivate a little bit, waterfall, mm. Delicate, mm -hmm. tinkling, tinkly. Does that make sense? It tinkles. Yes. 
I use those little fussy cords all the time. They twinkle so. They do, they Alex, do. totally. Hi, Alex. That's my friend. Oh, hello, <laughs> Alex. I'm his friend. Now, you're also going to be getting two millimeter faceted rounds on the rose cords. Oh, no, bear with me a second, sorry. It's saying they're three millimeters as well. Can you just check the sizes on those for me, please, Kim? I'd have put them at a two. Yeah, I think they're a two and a half, and these are a three. Yeah, two and a half, and these are a three and a half, folks. Two and a half, and these are a three and a half. Beautiful. And again, delicately, delicate, del del delicately, thank you. Uh, sporadically placed throughout the designs. And the two strands of genuine freshwater culture pearls. One's a, sh one's a shell pearl. Oh gosh, of course, that's shell pearl and that's freshwater culture pearls. Gosh, they look so pearl like. They don't do. They? they are amazing. Really, they are amazing. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful colour. You've got the um, shell pearl at 8mm and the culture pearls at 5 by 6 Full 38 centimetre strands on each. Now, in amongst these pieces, particularly this one, and now I can see you must have absolutely masses of amethyst left. Yeah, I've got yeah, I've got lots of I've got lots of quite every, of everything except for the um, the one you haven't come to yet. But yeah, that's the only thing I haven't got left. I'm coming. I'm brewing up to it. <laughs> so this is um, <coughs> excuse me, approximately an 85 centimetre strand. Mm. And these are genuine amethysts. They are completely natural. 200 carats, and they are just absolutely divine. And they are going from an approximate 4 by 6 up to an 11 by 9. Now, another big utter wow factor is this strand here. Now, this is Jasper. Jasper Nuggets, look at this design. I adore it, absolutely adore it. And dare I say, there's even Mookite quality to some of those Jaspers. I was wondering because it, you know you've got all those different colours in there, like yeah. Mookite. I know Mookite is a Jasper, but it's. Um, I just wanted to go all out with that because I love it. Stunning. And the big wow factor as well in that and um, this piece is bringing the pearls in. And it just sort of makes it a little bit more of a feminine look, doesn't it, bringing the pearls in? But also, look at the spacer beads in there, so those flashes of the silver. That makes a chunky necklace less chunky, but yeah. still you've got the chunky element and a little bit more delicate, so you don't have to be too concerned about wearing chunky, if that makes sense. Yeah. You will get ten of those spaces. If I show you the back of this necklace as well, you can see one of the toggle clasps there, sorry, the connectors in action. I'll show you the back of this necklace here because this is one of the actual toggle clasps in action and um, the chain. Now let's actually, now we're on to that, let's have a look at all the findings. So you're going to be getting a strand of rose quartz, a strand of clear quartz, a strand of shell pearl, a strand of fresh water culture pearls, a double the strand length of the other strands of amethyst and a strand of jasper. So one, two, three, four, five, six, some of you would consider that to be a seven strand kit. Mm -hmm. Amelia, move the scissors away from Mike's hair. <laughs> These two have been arguing, they're like an old, level, old married couple. Right, your findings, 115 findings, they're 95 sterling silver uh, plated copper, and we are going to be doing, oh my word, bearing in mind that you have got 6 slash 7 strands of genuine gemstones. 24.95. You've got 115 findings in this pack, giving you a meter of chain. You've got all of your spacer beads. You've got your crimp beads, crimp bead covers, your toggle clasps, your um, head pins, your featherweight head pins, your ribbon cord ends, and then just take a look at the end of these head pins because these are the little squares. Visa, Mastercard, and PayPal. So this is the only kit in today's show that gives you a full findings pack to get six. And some of you would view that because the amethysts are double the length of the other strands. A seven strand collection of gemstones. Oh, and we're chucking in 15 meters of the beading thread as well for free. That is amazing. Now, just before we continue, we are going to be learning how to do some of the techniques involved in this. But we do have two very special little guests. Oh, and Laura's here as well. <laughs> Laura, can I just say, congratulations on passing your driving test. And here is Laura with her very own little monkeys. 
They are just the most gorgeous Aww. children. This is Jackson and Kayla, everybody, Hi. who Laura frequently talks about on the show, so they are a part of the show. They're just here. Jeff, just right there, we'll be able to get a good shot. Is that right? Yeah. If they stand right in front of the Wall of Fame area? Are you ready to wave? Are you waving to Daddy? Yeah. Oh. Daddy's in the car. So, really important question. Did he come to see you? Did Father Christmas come? Yeah. <gasps> he did he? It was very borderline for a while. He was borderline <laughs> if Father Christmas was going to yeah, show. He decided, oh. decided to show in the end, didn't he? But yeah. Father Christmas did decide to come and visit the Binding household. Okay. And did Father Christmas bring you your beautiful frozen top? Yeah. No. No, you had, did you have that before? Yeah. Oh, you're so pretty. I love frozen. And you are so handsome, Jackson. Yeah, you are. He's gone shy. Oh, Laura and baby. And well, it's very, very, very lovely to see you. And right. thank you for lending mummy to us this afternoon. All right, right there. All right, we're going to go and play. Oh, are you fun. going to that place which has got a street where you use your imagination? Oh. Bye bye. Bye bye. Happy New Year. Bye. Bye. Oh, they're so gorgeous. cute. Yeah, we just had to take those off screen to make sure you knew that you couldn't purchase Laura Bindy's children <laughs> for the kit. Uh, right, okay. Twenty-four ninety-five for the kit. So, Sammy, what technique are you going to show to us? I'm just going to show how I got the um, the jasper to look like that, rather than just a single layer. Great. Okay. Um, so what? Yeah, because you can see it's. Uh, if you just put one, they will just kind of hang like teeth, won't they? Look very nice, but that's not very nice teeth. Yes. Yes. But that's not what I wanted to give like a bulky texture. Okay. And then change it with the, the thinner ones in between. So all I have done is I have put two bits of beading thread through a crimp bead and then, then I've used a crimp bead cover. So people that know me will know how much of a, an issue that can be for me, <laughs> crimp bead covers. So we've now got two, two pieces of beading thread um, and I'm gonna thread Three, it's all right, so I'll just bring that on there. I'm going to thread three of these Jasper onto one wire. I say it's not wire, is it? It's thread. Wow. <laughs> I'm so used to wire. Using anything that's not wire is usually an issue. There we go. We're going to thread it all the way down to the bottom. And then I'm going to thread three onto the other side. Now, when you're doing a full necklace like this, Whenever you do it, make sure you put to one side exactly the same number of gems so that you have it, you have it balanced. So when you get round to the other end of the necklace, you know where you are. So we're going to show three and three. And I, I do this and then you can see that they, they're beginning to go like that already. So what you want to do at this point is then put both of the wires through your next one and this one really does look like moot height so we're going to go all the way through I'm just threading both through there and you can see if you push that up nice and firmly that that's how you get it to sit like that uh, if you do any more than about three it doesn't seem to sit as well oh, okay so that's why I thought I just three and then you just can continue doing three and then you would slide your spacer bead on and you might need to ream the pearls slightly but I didn't have much of an issue. So then you would just put your pearls on and Lovely. carry on like that. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Uh, I love using these, these kind of nuggety things mm. to create that texture. But obviously the more strands you do, the bigger the texture it's gonna yeah. be. But yeah, if you're but that's just great advice, so two, don't go for more than about three. Yeah, and if you go for three and then put it through, you know, put both through, then that, that holds it together. If you go any longer than that, then you often end up with a bit of a gap and it doesn't quite sit as well. Mm. So it's best to do three, then then put one through and then do another three and then, and that's how you get that look there. I love it. I love, love, love it. And um, I think that kit has <laughs> almost sold out. I'm not surprised, it's beautiful. It's stunning. And I wanted to, to show how you can achieve all these different looks with one kit. So you've got, you know, you've got various different different looks from one kit, and I have got lots of gems left over. Apart from the jasper, I've only got a little bit of the jasper left over, but loads of the other ones. It just goes for miles and it goes on beautifully and delicate. On and, on. and if you Such remember, when you're wanting it to go on for, when you've got those gemstones left over, that's when it makes sense to go for things like our early bird, which are the three genuine, um, mm. sorry, the three ninety-five sterling silver plated findings packs. Are only fourteen ninety-five? Yeah. 
Yeah. Thank you. How's your challenge coming on what you're doing oh, now? Oh, I, I'm just about to start something else. Oh, I'm glad. <laughs> Yeah, right. We'll skedaddle over here. Um, we are. I'm really excited because I've just found out. Is it? Has it got the orange wrapper? <gasps> oh, it's my favourite. <laughs> There's a particular brand of chocolate that's arrived in the gallery, and it's an orange crunch one. Ah, uh, uh, and it's got the orange wrapper. Can I just see it? <laughs> Can I see it? <laughs> I'm going. I'm just going for it. I'm going to go home and gorge <laughs> and stinky cheese the cheese report in the afternoon because you can because it's Christmas time I'm going to gorge and then 2nd of December I think it'll be really good of January that's the one <laughs> you're going to go back in time and then undo no, all the damage no. gorge the whole year and then 2nd of December no 2nd of January yeah where's the chocolate no I need no I need it right here <laughs> you can't bring it in because you're germified I promise, I promise, I promise we won't get you on camera. I just need that chocolate near me. You don't understand. <laughs> it's Christmas. You can't walk, you're ill. You've got a cold. <laughs> this is Kim. Kim's got man flu. Really? Oh, no, it's an orange queen. Hang on, hang on. Oh! Hmm. <laughs> it's absolutely delicious, but it's not the same as they used to do them. Hmm. They used to be rectangular. But it'll, it'll satisfy the I need chocolate in my life now because I've gone for about two hours without eating it. Great thing. What am I going to do? I'm going to end up having total withdrawal symptoms. I'm going to end up getting the shakes. I will get the... In, in January, it's going to be full on detox. You don't understand. I've, gone, I've just gone for it in December. But that's it. Second of Jan. New Year's Day, I'll let myself. But second of January, I'll be good. Anyway, life story over. Let's do the 925 Sterling Silver Gemstone Collection, which has got your aquamarine fasted rondelles in it. Oh. I'm like approximately two by one millimetres, and it's 50 centimetres. Now... Aquamarine is one of the UK's fastest selling gemstones on the planet, done. So if you are doing commissions, Aquamarine is a great gemstone to go for. It's also an amazing gemstone if you're wanting balance in your life, which I do, <laughs> excuse me. It's truly beautiful. I think for a glasses chain, it'd be amazing. Let me just show this to you. <gasps> Can you imagine this in your hair? Oh, for a bride, oh! Oh, aquamarine is something blue for a bride. Oh, how beautiful would that be? That's 50 centimetres and it's touching at the back of my head. I think it'd probably work more without a fringe. Isn't ah oh, stunning. Let me hold it up to my neckline. Do you know what? I got really excited this morning. I thought, oh, my hair looks really, really shiny. Just got a few little bits. They're greys. <laughs> oh. oh, I'm sprouting them left, right and centre. It's ridiculous. It's because my hair needs re dying i haven't gone this i haven't got this one. i don't actually know my natural hair color no i don't <laughs> i don't know, really yeah well it's starting to show through i text my hairdresser saying we look like a group of grain wombles please help us <laughs> now look That's at beautiful. that clay you've got one gray hair in your fringe i'll just pull it out if i pulled out my gray hairs i'd have ball patches <laughs> seriously I would Kim has bought herself a Christmas present this year. She's bought herself some anti-aging moisturiser. How old is she? You are supposed to start in your late 20s. Yeah. You haven't got a tiny drop of wrinkle yet. I'll work with me, darling, for another year and you'll get them. <laughs> <laughs> right, 925 sterling silver. These are beautiful. I'll hold it onto my hand for you so you can see the uh, real detailing on this one. 925 sterling silver, 50 centimetres in length. Now to make this approximately one and a half metres, if not more, will have had to, oh actually, sorry, took close to two metres. 
of pure 95 sterling silver wire would be needed. Now look at that. Couldn't you just use that like little icicles to drape? That is That's... so beautiful. How about just use a few, literally the end of it. C can you imagine that as a delicate little earring on a 95 sterling silver shepherd hook? Yeah, it's gorgeous. What would you do with these, Sammy? Do you know those bales we had at the beginning with a half, you put half drill pearl, yeah. maybe you could hang some of those off the bottom. Oh. You've got a pearl and then you've got that because it's all silver. Yeah. And that just, um, yes, you have, no, you have, hang them, yeah, hang the drop from the bottom of the pearl. Like that? Well, yeah, you can do it that way round. So, but I'd have, I'd actually have the pearl on top and then the dangle underneath. Oh, I see. You Got could you. do that. It was gonna that would look gorgeous, I think. It might not, but I think it would. <laughs> no, it would. It would. It would. And we, you see, you've got a pearl in there, and then it all dangled down. Well, the because it's ninety-five stone silver as well. All the whole lot silver, yeah. <gasps> it's gorgeous. How are we doing on start levels, Kim? It's gorgeously delicate. It's like lace, isn't it? Oh, it's absolutely divine. Just really simple bracelet. How truly pretty is that? Well, that'd be amazing for a 21st gift or something, yeah. wouldn't it? My daughter would absolutely love that. I'd so love it, pretty. to be honest. <laughs> I don't know anyone who wouldn't. It's 95 stone silver, genuine, delicate, natural aquamarine from Brazil. 15 carats of aquamarine. Those are on dials measuring two by one millimetres. Good luck, everybody. Clearance price for the final few. <gasps> oh my word, do you know what you could pay just for the silver and then the fact that you look at that and that has been made by hand, it's been made in house in our very own workshops in Jaipur in India, which is why the price is so low because basically every single process, every step of the way has been done in house, cutting out a huge amount of middlemen, that is beautiful, Visa, MasterCard and of course PayPal as well, 0800 644 we are, don't uh, forget of course as well, we are fast approaching that incredible Druzy, I've also got an incredible Pyrite bundle on its way to you, the big huge chunky black fasted agates on their way, and more offers as well, so 27.95, how many left there Kim? Okay, less than 20 of these available, okay right now it's time for my chocolate as we go to the Wall of Fame. This is my fine, no it's not actually, I'm in tomorrow. Um, tomorrow will be my final visit to the Wall of Fame of 2014. But these designs are amazing. Final visit for today. Oh my word, 236. Hello, Susan in Hempstead. Mm. These are amazing. Hello, and I hope, sorry, Jenny's just doing a pig impression for me. She's got her nostrils pressed up against the window, looking into the studio. That's Jenny Clear, everybody. You're very elegant, sophisticated. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's just rubbed it down the window. She's vile. <laughs> oh, Hello, darling. That was really classy. Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas Jenny. Merry Christmas. <laughs> She'll be your presenter this afternoon. We'll love her. Uh, hello, I hope you all had a brilliant Christmas. Please, can you add my entry to the wall of fame draw? Made with a new silver wire ribbon and blue quartz from Jewelry Maker, silver plated wings and blue Schwarzkopf crystal from my sash. Kindest regards from Susan Beck in Hempstead and that is absolutely stunning. It's beautiful. 236, gorgeous. And gorgeous. The whole, whole composition of it is amazing. Now, this is absolutely divine. This is number 237 and it's from Sylvia Longhurst and it says, my first wire work bracelet. <gasps> what? what? Um, Lovely wire from Jewelry Maker. Thanks, guys. From Sylvia. Sylvia, thank that, you. That's your first go. That's amazing. Absolutely, absolutely blown away by that. You've obviously got a real Fabulous. natural flair yeah. for it. Stunning. Two, three, seven. Good luck. Oh, my word. This is just so peacocky. Mm -hmm. It's fabulous. Two, three, eight. And it says, hi, Jewelry Makers. My Wall of Fame entry has been an idea that's been rattling around in my head ever since you first sold the scale mail. I finally got round to making it. 
Uh, nearly all the materials used from Jewelry Maker, including the large green and the brown scales. And I wanted the wispy uh, effect with the, uh, the edges, which I did using the satin cord and the sparkly bronze leatherette cord. I'm amazed that JM can provide so much variety of product, which is so inspiring and on top of a staple gorgeous gemstones. The channel has gone from strength to strength and long may it continue from Debbie in Middlesex. Hello, Debbie. Thank you, darling. P.S. No, sorry, Hannah Osborne, who loves all things peacock. Can't have it, uh, but we'll consider a commission. <laughs> <laughs> nice one. That is amazing, hon. Oh, That's yeah. inspired. Well done. Two, three, eight. Good luck to you. I thought they were actual peacocks. Yeah, I did when I first saw it. This is just beautiful as well. It's simple. One of my faves that we've Simple done. and just beautiful. divine. Mm. Yeah, and this is what this is. I can't remember what number it is. Two, three, nine, and it's from Karen Atkinson. Please find attached my entry for this week's Wall of Fame, an amethyst and sterling silver bracelet made from a bracelet kit from Jewelry Maker. Good luck to everyone and I hope everyone has a happy new year. And that's Karen from Sussex. Happy new that year just to you, gorgeous, lovely, isn't it? Isn't it? So classy. Oh, so, so classy. So high end. This is just brilliant. Stunning. 240. This is from Jackie in Surrey. Dear all, here's my entry for this week's Wall of Fame, a celestial necklace I made from the silver plated wire, fast to clear quartz rondelles and rainbow hematite stars. All components are from Jewelry Maker and I was really pleased with how this turned out and have received many compliments. You're all a pleasure to watch and keep me giggling as well as learning. <laughs> Happy New Year and lots of love to all from Jackie in Surrey. Jackie, That's celestial and amazing. Well brilliant. Done. Two four zero. Love really it. fab, really fab. Yeah. So, quick break. When we come back though, it is time for the Druzy. The Druzy. Oh my word, it's just amazing. <gasps> it's going to be the most incredible bargain prize. Don't go anywhere. That's coming up. But right now, we've got lots of things going on online. So take a look at this. Do you need a helping hand to get started with Jewelry Maker? Are you stuck for ideas and need inspiration? Then visit our Jewelry Maker website where you can find our video tutorials. Expand your knowledge and skills with these easy to follow jewelry making demonstrations. Whether you're a beginner, hobbyist or business owner, there's always something new to learn. It couldn't be easier. Simply click and learn some new jewelry making techniques. You can now keep in touch by liking Jewelry Maker UK on Facebook. Get interactive with Jewelry Maker. We here at Jewelry Maker love to hear your feedback. So working in conjunction with FIFO, a global ratings and reviews provider, when you purchase a product from JM, you will receive an email asking you to rate our service and our products. This helps us to bring you excellent customer service and ensure we're bringing you value for money and high quality goods. Have your say with Jewelry Maker FIFO reviews. You can now keep in touch by following Jewelry Maker on Twitter. Get interactive with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker have an extensive range of DVDs for all abilities. Each of our mediums has an introductory DVD to help you get started. If you're already an experienced Jewelry Maker, we have a collection of projects and more advanced DVDs to take your designs to the next level. We are always filming new DVDs with our specialist guest designers, so visit our website for more information. The JM Awards were a huge success last year, so we're bringing it back bigger and better than before. Join Vicky and resident designer Linda Brumwell as we reveal the best bits of JM 2014 as voted for by you. So tune in on December 31st at 9am and help us celebrate the Jewelry Maker Awards. When shopping with Jewelry Maker, you can add as many items to your order in one day and only pay one postage and packaging charge. We have two delivery options. Standard delivery at just £2.95 and you'll receive your parcel within four to six days. Or opt for our premium delivery at just £4.95 and you'll receive your parcel within three to four days. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. You can now watch clips from Jewelry Maker on our YouTube channel. Get interactive with Jewelry Maker. Download the Jewelry Maker app today. You can watch our Jewelry Maker shows live, view all 
all the details of the item that is currently on air, as well as browsing all the items from today's show. You can also minimize the video or switch to use as a companion app. Get the Jewelry Maker app today and boost your viewing experience. What you're seeing is an absolute phenomenon of gemstone. First off, the big wow factor for me is the fact that you've got 100 carats, but just look at that gemstone from the most amazing different hues. It's a phenomenon of gemstone that happens, it actually happens quite frequently in terms of the actual process. But about 94% of druzy that's formed in the earth never makes it above the surface in a usable state because of the way that it forms and the way that it has to be mined. So, when it comes to druzy, it forms with either quartz or agate primarily. Lots of you will know this already, but you have these huge crevices in the earth. And at the point where all the main crevices are, that's where most of the quartz and agates formed. Silica um, is in um, a hot liquid that's sort of going around within the earth as well. This is putting it in very, very simple terms. And li hot liquid is constantly being pushed through the earth's surface. Now, if the hot liquid gets pushed between the crevices of quartz or agate and it holds silica and it cools very, very quickly, it latches on to its nearby area of either quartz or agate and continues to form into what's then known as druzy. Now, because of the way that it actually attaches on, the way that it's cut can be quite precarious, hence why a lot of it gets lost actually under the, the surface and never even, quite often, they just ditch it while they're still underground. But my word, when they find druzy that can be used, it can command some really, really high prices. Now, druzy is being used with a huge volume of um, big designer jewelers at the moment. This is probably some of the most prestigious uh, druzy that we've ever had. For me, as you look at it, it's almost like a true gemstone-encrusted velvet feel. Does that make sense? The, it's gone through a dyeing process, well, sorry, a coating process, which has enhanced the sparkle that's there with the purples, and you've then, you can see you've got these amazing bronze tones, gold tones, hues of blues popping through as well. Now, one of the main ways that people use these would be earrings, single pendants, but my word, they also make for really exquisite charm bracelets. How would you tend to use these, Sammy? Oh, rings and earrings, but rings, can you, just having that sparkling on your finger, just beautiful. Little heart shaped ring, a little bit of wire. You wouldn't need to do too much because they're drilled. So that's great. Yeah. It's not often we get drilled druzy in the gemstone industry at all. Now, for just one of these pieces, my work, do you know what? This is flying out. You're going to have to be quick off the mark. Congratulations to those of you buying more than one as well. Um, it will be a case of you having to be really, really quick. Look at, ah! Oh, <laughs> deepest riches of purples, burgundies, golds, and bronzes. My favourite colour, purple, funnily enough, with purple hair and purple glasses. <laughs> I do love, do love purple. <laughs> this makes for a, a really, really spectacular gemstone though, doesn't it? Because it, it does. it's so, so different. People love to see different things and um, how nature tells a story. I know it's coated, but you've still got that natural crystal across the front of it. Um, mm. People, it, just how it's formed in the ground. It just fascinates, and you know, it fascinates everybody. I wanted to prove a point. Let me show you, um, let me show you the back of a druzy. Okay, so there's the back of one. Okay, and that's gone through the coating process, so is the front. Now there's no different process in coating from the back to the front. Mm -hmm. So that just goes to show you how amazing that natural sparkle is. So the back and the front. What you could do is just have a simple chain and then have one dangling on a head pin at the bottom of the chain 
and that's just a beautiful simple make and it just because it is so gorgeous you can do that just classically elegant I think classically elegant stunningly beautiful ridiculously affordable good luck we are oh my goodness we're inundated we've got over half the stock has been confirmed we've got lots of uh, people with these in their baskets hello Venetia in the West Midlands my lovely and hello Denise and Karen and uh, Carol and Susan and Ruth and Patricia and Isabel and Nicola and Sarah and Barbara and Lena and Daisy and Annetta and uh, lots of anonymous shoppers. This is proving to be a huge, huge popular strand again with your extended money back guarantee until the 31st of January, just giving you those extra couple of days now. It's 17.95 and you're going to be getting approximately 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, approximately 17. So you're looking really at just over a pound per piece, which is truly ridiculous industry standards. Ridiculous, quite frankly. In the words of my producer, Kim, it's a bargain. Okay, we've got a little bit of a queue on the phone lines. Don't worry, we know you're there. And again, you're answering the order that you call in. Bod and Susan, and Tracy and Esther and Teresa. Now then, uh, Maria, Yvonne, Elizabeth, lots of anonymous shoppers, Venetia and Jill, Claire and Tina, Jacqueline, Lisa and Brenda, make sure you check out your baskets because we're close to selling out and I don't want you to be missing out on them. Um, can I just say I really like the idea of that combination. Mmm, oh. could even do a channel set bracelet, couldn't you? Amazing, absolutely amazing. TV lights isn't doing this justice at all. Oh eight hundred six triple four six four five. Remember, if you've got any questions for Sammy, we are live with Sammy for about another fifty minutes. Gosh, well, this show's going really quickly. It is possibly even quicker over the last few minutes because we've just started to dive into a box of chocolate. <laughs> really excited, <laughs> gorging while I can. What was your favourite thing to eat over Christmas, Mike? I always like the uh, turkey rolls after Christmas. The turkey? Yeah, well, the turkey, turkey rolls with cranberry sauce. I love that. Oh, it, the leftovers. Yeah. Lefto yeah, I'm a big, I'm actually eating some turkey throughout the show today. Um, I think my favourite though this year was we found a really good, because you know I'm allergic to nuts. You might not have done, I'm allergic to nuts, there you go. Uh, a nut-free Christmas pudding with cold brandy sauce on it. Hot. Christmas pudding with cold brandy sauce in it. Yeah, I've been indulged in that a lot, a lot. And we do a, a thing every year now where rather than getting, you can feel with the amount of booze that you have over Christmas, you can feel a bit. <laughs> so we do cocktails from Christmas Eve and they're carrying on. And we have an area of our kitchen that you can't do anything with because it's just everyone brings their bottles and we make cocktails. So that's been very exciting this year, making up cocktails and things. Why am I doing this big detox cleanse thing in January? <laughs> I don't think I should do it either. I will give all you my booze to you and you can do it. Yeah. Uh, right, let's move on to this amazing. Now, this is absolutely amazing. We had a Wall of Fame entry earlier with turquoise in it. This is beautiful turquoise. Look at the colour of this. Genuine turquoise. Completely genuine turquoise. This is not a dyed howlite. It's reconstituted, which means natural turquoise has been taken, ground down to a very fine powder and rebound together again with a resin. Uh, but this is amazing, genuine turquoise. Oh my word, they're huge. It means that you're able to get that consistency of color, consistency of size. Oh right, we're gonna sell out. How many have we got? Pardon? And what price are you doing at? Right. Do me a favour, folks, if you trust me that this is going to be, I think, the lowest price we've ever done turquoise at per carat, I reckon it is. I honestly think this is the lowest price we've ever done real turquoise at per carat. If you trust me, phone now, you can always put the phone down, and if you trust me, put it in your basket, you can always not check your basket out. Trust me and get on the phone line now. Honestly, 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 honestly. Trust me, trust me, trust me. It's one of December's birthstones. It's one of the most in-demand gemstones in the world. And if you were to buy one strand from us today, you get this one. Seriously, this is going to be ridiculous. Thank you so much. I've got masses of you trusting me. How are we doing on the phone lines, Kim? 
Okay, we're forming a little bit of a queue. Don't worry. We know you're there. Get answered in the order that you call in. We've got a massive quantity of this. We've got over 200 of these available. Glynis and Stephanie, Cynthia and Anne, Tina and Cindy, Alexandra, lots of anonymous shoppers and Daisy and Kerry, Elizabeth and Lainey and Kate and Shirley and Cynthia and Mei Ling and Mona and Samantha and again, oh right, you're going to have to, ah, oh, be as quick as you can. This is, honestly, I truly believe this is one of the lowest carrot prices per carrot we've ever had. AGP096, I love it, 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 I love it. And Mike... I know you're sort of busy doing cameras and everything, but could you possibly just grab me the Wall of Fame entry, please? 235, uh, top right-hand side. Because these were really, really similar beads, and it was such a gorgeous design. Thanks for trusting me, folks. Honestly, 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 honestly. Don't want to do this because I can feel my bingo wing that's developed over Christmas boggling away. Uh, <laughs> this means you can keep waiting for longer. Right, if I just keep doing this. <laughs> Only one on chicken dance. I need to get it back again. What's the price of this, Mike? It's... Crazy. No, phenomenal. We'll change it for 2015, but today it's... Phenomenal. Do, 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 do. Phenomenal. Do, 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 do. Phenomenal. Do, 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 One-armed chicken dance. Ooh. Right. I put a bit of effort into it. You did put effort oh, into it. Do, it's not going to be the last one. We'll do it again tomorrow, and then we'll change it for 2015, <laughs> maybe. Uh, right, this was from Irene, and um, I, that's Irene's use of turquoise there. They look beautiful used alongside the uh, black abalone shell. Beautiful. Right, okay, Samantha, you are my kind of woman. You've got yourself three, Tracy's got two, Mona's got two, Lynn's got two. Honestly, you will be kicking yourself. Because do you think it'd be fair to say, Sammy, that if we were to do these for 24 95 for genuine turquoise, it'd be good? Yeah, it'd be an amazingly good price. Cause... 24 95 would be amazingly good. Yeah. And that's from our professional jewellery maker, Sammy, who has experience, obviously, in this type of thing, because she is a pro. So $24.95 would be phenomenal for this strand. Now, did you trust me? How many people on the phone line, Tim? OK. So we need a few more of you for this to sell out. We're going to sell out of this. $24.95 would be amazing, wouldn't it? Yeah. Can everybody on the website already see the price, Kim? Ready? And we're doing it for $9.95. This is, uh, oh, it's Christmas. No, it's not. Oh, it's New Year. No, it's not. We're in limbo. And we're doing it for $9.95. We're in limbo. We're in limbo. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what that means. I don't know. This is the, we're in limbo. <laughs> Do you like it? It. Yeah. Oh, no, I'm exhausted. <laughs> Burn off all that chocolate and cheese. And that turkey. Turkey, those are really lean meats, so it's okay. Do you know what? My mum was hilarious on Christmas Day. I sat there eating away and I went, oh, I don't even want to think about the calories I'm having right now. And she went, well, Lucy, if you think about it, it's all right. Because the sprouts were only boiled. And you've got the chestnuts in there. That's good protein. <laughs> and turkey's very lean meat. And she was justifying why I could gorge on it more. And then when I slopped on a smetched bread sauce, she went, and that's where your calories are. <laughs> right, so 9 95 9 95 9 95 9 95 Pardon? It's mad. Mad price. So I was just saying, um, have you had, do you want some of the fruitcake, by the way? Oh, yes, some please. Fruit cake. Yeah. Love some fruitcake. Yeah, I ate it for breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. It's got fruit in it. Exactly. That is exactly what Director Glarish just said. Oh, it's obscene. Oh, it's been obscene. <laughs> I've never gorged like it before. <laughs> I've just gone for it. Oh, it's all right. I've got my gym membership for the new year. I'm really <laughs> so excited eat, about eat responsibly. It. <laughs> oh, <that's one> guy. <laughs> it's just the, my choices, you know? Why go for milk in your coffee when you can have a floating Irish coffee and have four inches of cream on the top? Well, when you put it like that, why would you? <laughs> oh, why have a hot chocolate when you could have a double Bailey's whopped in there? <laughs> Pardon? What does Sammy have around her neck? 
mic's nice. <laughs> yeah, oh. <laughs> Jenny, oh. Sammy's wearing a beautiful pendant. Sammy, do you mind if we get a close up of that no, pendant that's that you're wearing, it's, please? It's an amatrine from from here, and then I've wrapped it with uh, wrapped it with sterling silver. It's absolutely beautiful. And you've got a tiny yellow sapphire accent on there oh. as well. All from Jewelry Maker. Absolutely stunning. Um, Jenny says, Mike's nice. Mike, come on screen and advertise yourself to Jenny, please. Oh, <laughs> oh okay. Off he pops. But is he single? That's the question. Yes, he is single. He's single. Yeah. Oh. So, uh, Mike, um, plans for the new year? Are you uh, going on holiday this year? Um, oh, well, 2015? Potentially. Potentially, what are you thinking? I don't know yet. I want to go to Mexico still, Cancun. Yeah. Yeah. So I could do that. Who are you going with? I don't know right now. Well, I was going to go with some friends this year and it didn't work out. You know, so. Yeah. Oh. Maybe, uh, what are your two, Jenny? Mm. Fancy a bit of Cancun. <laughs> I just realised I sort of went into it. That would be weird, though, wouldn't it? So, anyway, thank you for. <laughs> <laughs> Really well, the fact that you've never met before, not that you're weird, Jenny, is not saying that because you were never met before. Uh, <laughs> and did you say we've got another text in? No? Yeah? But to Lucy! How long is the strand? It's 38 centimetres, Alex! Oh. 38 centimetres, sorry. It's always 38 centimetres here at Drawmaker, unless otherwise stated. And that's from bead to bead. Oops. Chocolate is from a bean, and beans are good for you. <laughs> so enjoy. Tink. Thanks, Tink. Yeah. Chips are made from potatoes as well, aren't they? <laughs> Wensleydale and Cranberry has fruit. fruit in it. It's fine. Do you know what? I'm just going to go for it till the 2nd of January. I don't know. Do you, can I show you something I brought in today? I brought in today. I thought, honestly, I thought it was going to be good. Look, how depressing is that when you've just been gorging all over Christmas? <laughs> how depressing is that? Seeds. Yeah, you can wait till the new year. Depressing. Oh, wait, hundred six triple four six double five. Is that Amelia? Bye. Did you know there's a box of chocolates in there? Oh no, I've got some. Thank you. I've got. I've eaten three. <laughs> they're not in there anymore. No, they're here. Oh, that's because they're here. <laughs> Go on. Yeah, but I think you need that energy for when you're going to shoot those pipes up your armpits and all of that <laughs> which my flip flop. I've got to lose the chunk. Oh, what chunk? What oh, chunk? You know Look what? at you. It hasn't got... You have a baby, then you'll know what chunk around no, your middle is. You. No, she's like, no, 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 thank you. Travel, no. Travel, travel. no, she's just going to travel and go on pipes and things, yeah. Um, now then, we've moved on. Um, is it okay that I disagree with the graphics? I know I've got one here, thank you. Please take those away from me. Move the chocolates. No, move them away. I've already, no, I've already, no. Seriously, no, thank you. No, no. Oh, no. No, please move them away. <laughs> Phil, did you bring these chocolates in? I literally love you more than I even did before. Did you have an all right birthday even though you were poorly? It was, yeah, it was all right. We missed you. Yeah. It wasn't the same how not having you around. This is Phil, producer like. Phil, everybody. Are you going to be producing the Designer Inspiration Show? Yes, okay. He's producing the Designer Inspiration Show. And can I ask you, did you bring chocolates in because you have such an excessive amount at home you don't know what to do with them? We just don't fancy that sort of chocolate at home. You don't fancy that sort of chocolate at home? No. What sort of chocolate do you fancy? Just the big bars, like the nine bars that I saw that you have actually got of all the same type, or is it five? Uh, they were my brother's girlfriends. They were your brother's <laughs> girlfriends. Oh, I tell you, he just likes a nice slab of chocolate, where these are more of the decadent, pop one in your mouth and it hasn't counted chocolates. Right, take a look at this. And the reason I'm dis disagreeing with the graphics is because it says size J to K, R to S. Now, Kim, does that mean this one ring size can either be J to K or R to S? 
there are two different sizes so you can order the size that you want however the thing is yeah it's 925 sterling silver and it's completely adjustable you can even overlap so the size will be when it's completely shut that's gorgeous so Sammy how would you use one of these does this annoy you a little bit Just no because no because I like um, I like because I know it. that you're a silversmith as well and you can make you more you make your own pieces so yeah but that's quite a difficult thing to achieve solo silversmith you know without using molds and everything else so uh, it that doesn't doesn't annoy me too much okay <laughs> so we give you one of these and what do you do well, you could do, uh, you could put polymer clay in it. Mm. You could give it to Fiona Potter. She'd do some amazing resin in it. Uh, you could al almost um, do a cluster, massive, massive cluster ring. Lots and lots of things. Um, head pins around the things in the bottom. I and just love a real that. That's stack, what I was thinking. Uh, you know, have a massive opulent stacked cluster ring, which is what I do with it because although I, I like doing small and delicate, I love doing big and fabulous. So... Yes. Just literally jam <laughs> tons of gemstones in there. Yeah. Because you could. Oh. We could do. Literally make loads of collections of these and just have them. Ah. Oh. Couldn't you? We're going to do that bundle next, actually. Now this has previously been 1595. It's a solid 925 sterling silver, adjustable ring. It measures 25 by 20 on the top of the oval. You've got big size on the bezel at the sides. You've got the opportunity to do so many different designs, perhaps even interchangeable designs. Because <clears throat> you create, you could create a base that wire wraps in, couldn't you? Are you ready? Oh my word, 9.95, bulk buy, bulk buy, bulk buy, bulk buy, bulk buy. So when people call up, Kim, just to confirm, or on the website, are they purchasing a J to K or an R to S? You choose which one you want. There are exactly the same quantity of each size. <coughs> Excuse me. There are now less of the J to K. Lee is an H. That's really tiny. She's got baby fingers. You look like you have sausage fingers compared to her. That's attractive. What size are you? You're tiny as well. No, I'm, um, I think I'm a K. You're a K. Yeah, nice rebellion. Lovely. Right, this is a... Uh, Nine ninety-five. I'm an eye and a half. If anybody would like to purchase me a ring, thanks. Um, but look, that's on my wedding finger. Oh, it's ages since I, because I used to work on Gems TV. I used to be ringing away, ringing away. Oh, eight hundred. Six double four, six double five. Right, let's move on. And we're gonna do, right, we're gonna do this bundle. This has been the bundle that's been sat there going, buy me, buy me, buy me, buy me, buy me, buy me, buy me throughout the whole show. Buy me, buy me, buy me. <laughs> buy me. This has gotta be the biggest saving. I think this is the biggest saving in the whole show. Yeah, seriously. Oh, I care, Kim. I care. That crash bang in a wallet that nearly happened could have been a whole box of chocolates on the floor, it but it wasn't, so all is good. Right, there's loads of you flying in for these already. So they're all 36 centimetre strands. They're in approximate 6 to 65 carats on each strand. 
and they go from a two by one up to a four by three. They are so spectacularly beautiful, 36 centimetres. You see, those are your accenting bees, aren't they? Oh, 800, six double four, six double five. MJGC72, right, Charlotte's of anonymous shoppers, Jenny, Leslie, Edwina. This should be £41.70. This should be £41.70. And if you just heard it, ah! It's because Amelia, I think she half made a cup of tea about an hour ago. And she's just realised something. I don't quite know. She's like, I've never made it. So there's probably a little bit of stagnant gravy sat in some cups over there. Uh, right then, a very, very, very warm welcome to all of you. I was about to say good morning, but it is indeed the afternoon. We're fast approaching the end of the show this morning with bargains coming at you left, right and centre. Make sure you're checking out your baskets. Well then, Shirley, Margaret, lots of anonymous shoppers. Uh, Tina, Dawny, Elizabeth, Kim, Jane, Claire, Anne, Suze, Jane, Carolyn, Linda, Tina, Carol Ann, Sean, Catherine, Jenny and Jacqueline, Edwina and Leslie and Betty and Anne. Good luck, good luck, good luck, good luck, good luck. These are amazing. And at £24.95, when they've been over £40 for all of them, usually £24.95 for six strands. I love those with accent beads. I use them quite often as accent beads. Do you? Yeah. I love a little accent bead. Um, they're really good when you're doing wire work because quite often if you're doing a big piece you'll have to add some wire in mm. so if you just put if you've got a, an, an area that you just want to hide just put a little accent bead over the top of it nice if you've added something in or just it, it, because it works in the form of a design they just and you add really value well. as soon as you put a gemstone in there as you well you do and it's just a little bit more interest too but yeah, I just love them. They're so sparkly. They catch the light amazingly. And I love a bit of bling. <laughs> Who doesn't love a bit of bling? It's not that lovely just like that. Oh, wow. That would be good, wouldn't it? Oh, my teenage daughter would just adore that. Mm. May. We've seen somebody called Mei Ling has been buying this morning. My daughter's called Mei Ling. <laughs> Are you sure it's not it's her? It's not her. She's a different, different county. It's fine. Are you sure? <laughs> Absolutely positive. Or would it come up in your name? It would come up in my name. Yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> 2495 0800 They're just <laughs> beautiful. What are you apologising for, Amelia? <gasps> She's apologising because... Has that tea bag been sat in there for 20 hours then? <laughs> no. Amelia's apologising for bringing us a cup of I tea because it was late and she thought, you've just brought us a cup of tea, thank you very much. Twenty four ninety five. I just, ah. Oh. <laughs> right. Now then, I think it's fair to say that Sammy and I have been literally a bit <clears throat> about this one. Yeah, I see it there all day. I just, they're just my kind of thing. Ooh. Because you can put them with anything or use them on their own and they're just so dramatic and sparkly and classy and lovely. And cute, just amazing. They are That's absolutely it. stunning. They are black agates. Bear with me a sec. day. I want to know what you're all up to New Year's Eve. Will you let me know? What are you doing New Year's Eve? Eve. New Year's Eve day, I'm going to try and persuade my husband to go shopping. <laughs> With our toddler. <laughs> if he won't go, you'll go. You're on. I don't. Claire is so broody. What's that got to do with the price of fish? <laughs> All right, no, I think more that... Yeah, she's, you won't want to go shopping with a toddler. It's not fair on toddlers to go shopping. It's not fair. But if we go to this specific place, they've got a soft play area that does really good coffee as well. So Drew and Charlie could stay in there and I could have a bit of a bin shop. That's what we need here. A man crush. A man crush. For people coming on workshops. We could have a man crush. There needs to be more of those, I think. Yeah, man crushes. Yeah. <laughs> you up for that, Mike? A man crush. <laughs> no. 
Maybe. We'll see about that. Because yeah. quite like shots, He's not going to commit, is he? Because he's a bloke. That's true. <laughs> he's going to go maybe until it. <laughs> Are you the word? You don't. Oh. Enjoy. Oh. You're a good bank carrier. Oh, he turns into a better catch by the second. Okay. Right, let's do this off. They're 38 centimetres in length each of them. You've got 230 carats of the faceted rice beads, okay? And these are measuring 30 by 10 millimetres. They are stunning. Absolutely stunning. Now these are 10 millimetre fasted rounds. Then, you've got these ones, <coughs> excuse me. Fasted pairs, 25 by 18. Oh, sorry, uh, no, they're the drops, 18 by 13, and these are the pairs, 25 by 18. Glamour, 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 glamour. Free phone number 0800 655. Are you ready for quite possibly one of the most sensical purchases ever? This is amazing, 21.95. They are big, beautiful gemstone strands. And I wouldn't have batted an eyelid at our prices, each one of those being 9.95, 12.95, 14.95 each. Surely that's a strand that's 14.95, surely. The size of them. And these probably what? 11.95, 12.95, these definitely 14.95. And then maybe 9.95 on those. Look at them all in their own right, they're spectacular. <gasps> Do you know what, it'd look amazing as well, making your own chandelier with these. Oh yes. Bit with of a gothic bit. feel to oh, them, just yes. with the light bouncing of the facets, they're amazing. Oh, wait, hundred six double four six double five. I love them. Okay, I'm now about to do some ninety-five sterling silver. They are really, 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 really popular. And if you've got any gemstone strands of distinction, have those sold out now, Kim? So, might we recap them? Shall I keep them here? Okay. Oh. Oh. Check these out. Nine two five sterling silver, nine carat yellow gold plated toggle clasps. Nine two five sterling silver and nine carat yellow gold plated. Pla why, why am I losing the ability to say the word plated today? Have you noticed? Mm. Plated. Nine two five sterling. Nine carat yellow gold plated. <laughs> ha. <Huh. laughs> oh, I tell you something. The girl scrubs up well today. I yeah, and I haven't looked at your face. Um, 13 millimetres on the actual toggle and 22 millimetres on the bar. Now you're going to get a pack of three of these. If you're using a prestigious high-end gemstone, then these are an essential, essential, essential must-have, aren't they? Because you don't just want to finish it off with anything. Just anything. Have that attention to detail, isn't yeah. it? really important. I think it's really lovely the what you were saying earlier actually about the fact you've got a commission to do a male and female piece set. Oh, no, it's so I'm looking this immediately now I think a lady's pendant and men's cufflinks. Yeah that's a lovely using idea. Using the three. If you can hear the dulcet towns in the background it's Jenny Cleary. <laughs> with a very pert with a very pert bottom after the Christmas period my word. Very fat. It's not fat, Jenny. <laughs> You're talking out of it now. Let's have a look. 100. 644. 655. Let's have a look. So, three of these. 695. This is no dead. 
Yeah. <laughs> 95 cents silver, and I've got loads of you who are taking advantage of this. Well done, Stacey and Kathy, uh, Karen and Jackie and Eddie and Catherine and Celine. Oh, I love that name. And Tina and Linda and Valerie and Valerie. Uh, Glenda and <laughs> Eleanor and another Valerie. Uh, Valerie and... Oh, two Valerie's in Yorkshire. Hello, Valerie's in Yorkshire. Susan in Hampshire, Sylvia in Merseyside. Hello, Pat in Essex and Beverly in Fife and Angela in Nottinghamshire and lots of anonymous shoppers. 6.95 for three. I'd definitely multiply that. That can't be right for solid silver, surely. Well, it's not standing silver, darling, because you've got the gold added plated. adornment of yeah, the nine carry yellow gold. I know, I know. but Bonkers. wow. Wow. That can't be right, surely. Absolutely bonkers. Visa, MasterCard, and of course, PayPal accounts as well. EHGP52. 13 millimeters for your actual toggle and 22 millimeters for the bar going across the top. Okay, moving along. Moving along on my push. That's not. What's that? How does that song go? I don't even know what song that is, sorry. <laughs> but I sang it so eloquently. <laughs> But it was such a complete song. It's not you, it's me. <laughs> oh, yeah, I know what you mean now, but I haven't got a clue. I swear I've asked this question before. It's this song that just keeps popping up into my head. <laughs> now. <laughs> oh, my word. I love you. These would be so pretty. With the, the rose gold plate. Do you love your own school? <laughs> Jenny's just gone, I just love my own school. I said it in an Italian accent. Was that Italian? You love it all the gold. Love, love it all the gold. <laughs> si, si. Bella. Bella. Wow. Bella. Wow. How offensive can we be to every accent? <laughs> <laughs> it's not offensive. No, I'm not saying you're offensive. It might be to come across that I'm offensive because I'm trying to do the Italian accent and I'm blatantly bad at it. No, nice earrings. Jenny? Thanks, they were stolen from Tracy, the new um, silver... They were stolen lady. from Tracy, the new silver... They're amazing, aren't they? Bring him in. Bring him in low here. No... I know you look like a boiled egg right now. Jenny's words, <laughs> not mine. <laughs> no way. They're lovely, are Are you wearing they? them in the show? Oui. And Will we're you... taking them off. She's never taken these off. This is the back... This is Jenny, everybody. <laughs> well, there's the back of her neck and her earring. Oh, and my Jenny. Neck. Thank you. It's a bit moly <laughs> for my liking. Can I reverse now? You can reverse. Boop, boop, boop. <laughs> this vehicle is reversing. Did you have a lovely Christmas? Yes, I did. Did the kids have a nice yeah. one? Yeah. Did Father Christmas come and bring some presents? Yeah, yeah was it really yeah. exciting? Oh. Did Father Christmas bring you some presents? Uh, yes. Horse related? Uh, actually, yes, we did have lots of horse related things. Yes, me and Caprice, yes, which is great. And today our horse is racing at Kelso. Oh. 3.30, surprise vendor. Woo. Okay, Jenny will tell you all the horse information during her show, I'm sure, because she just said, and I should learn the piano, and I didn't understand any of it. Right, <laughs> this is 95 silly silver, nine carat rose gold plated toggle class. They are so beautiful. And with those pearls from the kit, mm -hmm. even with the amethyst that Sammy's got for her challenge today, these are, oh, this is absolute favourite of mine. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. The code is URGP68. I just think rose gold is so wearable for anyone of any age yeah. and you can mix it with any metal. It's flattering to so many skin tones, isn't it? Really does, yeah. Yeah, really does. And I can be proof of that. Because some days I can look practically blue and if I have severely faked hand, I can look practically like I've been to the Caribbean for a week's holiday. <laughs> Uh, you are GP, and it still looks nice on both. Uh, you are GP69. Are you ready? 695 once again for nine carat rose gold plated 925 sterling silver. It's beautiful. Amelia, it's really concerning me the lack of chocolate you're eating and the sheer volume of garlic that you are. I've got willpower of steel. You, you do, have got willpower of steel, just like your little bottom after doing that <laughs> ridiculous, <laughs> insane workout oh, thing. Like I need to. I need to do that. Do you want it? Yes. Hello, Coral. Hello. Did you have a lovely Christmas? Yeah, I did. Thanks. And, um, what did you? What did Father Christmas bring for you? A citrine necklace. A citrine necklace. Are you serious? Yeah. Oh my word! Oh, congratulations! Beautiful! Look how happy you are! Well, it is the gemstone of happiness, and apparently, if you wear it, it makes you feel really happy. Is it working? 
It's working. Oh, bop, 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 bop. Right, uh, where to next? Now, I'll just recap because we've got the early bird here. And um, just a few findings. Just a few. Mike and Amelia, behave yourselves. Honestly, working with these two is like literally working. It's like they've been married for about 50,000 years and at the point where they've irritated each other so much. It makes good friendships. It? it is. You two are very good friends. It's stinky. Uh, right, take a look at these. <laughs> Step away from the mic, Amelia. Step oh, away oh, oh. from the mic. 0800. Six double four six one five. So that huge, ridiculous cacophony of uh, findings consists of three findings packs. Here's the first one. And the second one. And the third one, giving you approximately 354 findings. There's a lot of people in the in the building today. I wasn't expecting it to be so busy with it being this uh, Christmas festive period. Mm. Fourteen ninety five. Oh eight hundred six double four six double five. Ninety five sterling silver plated copper. Fourteen ninety five for that volume of findings. It's practically ridiculous of ridiculousness. Now, we have also got a 925 sterling silver today, these incredible bales, and they are truly, truly beautiful. So the whole idea behind them is that you use a half-drilled gemstone and pop that onto there. You don't have to. You can be really creative and inventive and wire wrap around it and having drips of it, etc. Now, the idea would be that you'd pop your pearl there and then put your chain or cord of choice through the bale at the back but there's lots of different ways I can think to using these they really are reminding me of the Maori symbol of a fish hook oh eight hundred six trouble four six double five KGRF84, free phone number 0800 644 Are you ready? Are you steady? 695 for the three. And there's a lot. It's not just the volume of the silver with the silver weight there. This is about the actual amount of hand craftsmanship that's gone into making each of these as well. And when you think, ah, oh, there's scope for using these again with the amethysts. 0800. Love that form, that flow. Yeah, it's just a beautiful flow. Very you, actually. It is, it is. Your That's work that you create has always got such a beautiful, yeah, flow is the perfect word. Thank you. Love Sammy's work. And Jenny claims her for her own. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> she, she does live no, around the her. corner. <laughs> I know she lives around the corner. So, are you saying that you belong to Jenny? I, I'm my own person. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> correct answer. The divine, the absolutely divine. Is it just me? Has the temperature dropped in here? It is a cold day today, isn't oh, it? Oh, it was. Yeah, I'm hoping it's warmer than when I arrived because <laughs> that was really cold. Yeah, I'm thinking it I, would be. I left at minus four, and then we went through a, a warm patch of minus one, and then got and it was minus four when I got here again. <laughs> See, my brother's just come back from living in Kuala Lumpur, where it averages about 37 degrees a day. Yeah, my sister all year round. round. And this is a little bit of a shock to the system, to say the least. Oh, 0800, six double four, six double five. Okay, let's go on to another La Wire. This is an amazing offer today, and we've literally taken it to a ridiculous clearance price. It's 10 95 It's usually 19 95 and we're doing it for 10 95 today. Um, have a look around, do your shopping around. You've got your extended money-back guarantee until the 31st of January. But this is 100 metres of the point six. Oh, 
It's going to be 10.95. MRZX42, usually 19.95. It's on offer today, but only until nine o'clock tomorrow morning. And then it'll be 19.95 again, and that will be really good still, but you might as well get it at 10.95. 0800 And um, Have we got any more of those big, chunky, mahusive, amazing toggle clasps left? Just seeing. Can we, can we, can we, can we, can we? Right, if you haven't yet seen these, you need these in your life. They're mahusive, they're monstrously, fabulously gorgeous, and so, 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 so on trend. And for Sammy and I, the look of the day is that. Rah. Mm -hmm. That could be day wear or evening wear. Yeah. It's got that kind of elegance about it. Uh, it's just fabulous. Love, 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 love. Love, love, love. The gemstones love, <laughs> love, 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 love. <laughs> the extra side thing about the gemstones. Right then, so you are going to be getting three. <laughs> I think that chocolate's gone to my brain. <laughs> probably has. My brain is pure chocolate after the Christmas season. Gorgeous big chunky toggle class. So these are the hammered style. They're 34 millimetres in diameter and 57 uh, millimetres for the T-bar. Then you've got the T-bar at 50 centimetres and that round is 30 millimetres. So I just say 50 centimetres, it's not 50 millimetres. <laughs> 40 millimetres and 29 millimetres for this part here. 0800, six trouble four, six double five with nine carat yellow gold plating. This is truly phenomenal. I think, honestly, the price for one of these would be fantastic at 6.95. What is going <laughs> Amelia and Mike, you are hilarious. I think Amelia and Mike should have their own show. <laughs> Tom and Jerry, wouldn't it? It would be a little bit like Tom and Jerry or um, a bit like Hale and Pace. Wow, whatever happened to them? Whatever happened to Hale and Pace? Hey, who? They're saying, oh, you're so young. <laughs> yeah, go away. No, not Laurel and Hardy. <laughs> oh, you think these guys would be like, yeah, you two are Laurel and Hardy. Can I be the no, no, he's the skinny one. Why does it mean that he's the skinny one? He's I'm because sure he's skinny. You're skinny too. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> I love my team so much. Oh. Right then, where to next then, Kimbo? Oh, I'll just have a slurp of my tea while she's thinking. Oh, mm. Okay. Any more texts coming, Kimbo? It's very quiet on the texting, Malarkey. Okay. Okay, ignore the graphics that just came in. Kim did it wrong. <laughs> okay, there are five hair combs in the rose gold colour, five hair combs in the silver colour, five hair bands in the rose gold colour, five hair bands in the silver colour. Earrings using those fine as well. And you just made the earrings using the fine Thank you very much. Ah, oh. oh, lovely. Now, this is a combination of the gemstones that we gave to Sammy for her challenge of the amethyst, but she's used those findings there. Ah, oh. quite art deco y. Mm. Love them. Yeah, lovely. So the shepherd hooks, the this binding here, the jump rings, and then the chain, Ooh. and the featherweight headpins. Not the oh, featherweight actually, you don't headpins, get the featherweight headpins, but everything apologies. else. But you could use the spinel that came in there, and it would look yeah. amazing. Complete earrings. Mm. Gorgeous. So, within these packs, each matrix box, you're going to be getting a metre of chain, you're going to be getting little rectangle um, spaces, you're going to be getting jump rings, spinel and the silver one, three of the chandelier-style uh, drop findings, 
two S class, the toggle class, and two pairs of shepherd hooks. Same again with the rose gold colour, but you get the smoky quartz. I even remember this is seventeen ninety five, isn't it? Because I think that that's a standout one for me in today's show. Have you seen the way as well that Sarah Elvin has been using the hair combs recently? No. Completely genius way of using them. I've literally, I'm going to do it now, splaying them out. And then you can actually, I'm not showing this very well at all. Um, I'm really not showing this and doing it justice at all. But basically, Sarah's taken some of the hair combs and used it. You can use that then as a starburst for a tiara. How cool is that? Isn't that lovely for, you can then wire up into that to use that as a crown or even to form, you can then hammer it because we've got the hammer and the block, put it flat. I've done this incredibly quickly and then you can then work on that as a base. Yeah, um, amazing. It doesn't it? Hair comb, just to use it in a completely different way, it's genius. So free phone number 0800 644 655. Talking about genius, the binding is in the studio and she's passed the driving test. <laughs> Do you feel like, can you, have you driven here today? I drove from a supermarket. You drove from the supermarket <laughs> around the corner. She nearly I, name dropped which supermarket. I see out. It is. I, have gone out of my I was going to say, it's a precarious time of year once you've just passed your driving test. I know we had a. Yeah, we hadn't. Yeah, car crash yesterday. Um, I'm very proud of you, Laura. Oh, thank you. Do you feel like you've got a completely new lease of life? Yeah, I am. I, I took the kids out for um, midweek on my own. She took the children oh. out midweek on her own. Oh, I thought you said for midweek. Yes. Oh, we've just had a text in from Anne in Suffolk. Hello, lovely. Hi, Lizzie and Sammy. Well, I had to succumb to that beautiful Druzy. Had no intention of buying. My favourite colour is purple, like Sammy. I have purple hair. Great show and designs as usual. Happy New Year to everyone. Happy New Year, Anne. Thank you so much for sending the uh, text in. Thank you for spending the time to do so. Mwah. Happy New Year. Now, if everyone checks out their baskets for the Druzy, it has now gone. Okay, and then we're just going to quickly recap the lowest price turquoise put... Turquoise? Turquoise! Don't know why accent that was supposed to be either. The lowest price turquoise that we have ever had per carat, I think, here at Jewel Maker. Not completely confirmed, but suspiciously... Whatever the word is I'm trying to do. Three hundred and forty carats. Now this is the strand. If you missed that earlier, I was saying if you trust me that when I say something is going to be an amazing deal, it's an amazing deal. You'll be calling now. Three hundred and forty carats. Three hundred and forty whopping carrots. How many carrots? 340 humongously fabulous carrots. AGP096. Are you ready? 995. This is genuine turquoise. And um, it's reconstituted, so we've taken natural turquoise, ground it down, and then literally rebound it together with resin. That means that we can get sizable pieces of turquoise so chances are potentially thousands of little chips of turquoise were sourced to then form this so you're able to get bigger pieces of turquoise rather than have lots of little tiny 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 pieces does that make sense basically stuck them all together Fab. 
9.95 oh eight hundred six double four six double five love that i really 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 love that be lovely with pearls wouldn't it right it's the end of the show how did that happen how did that actually happen time well time flies when you're having fun if you have fun everybody i hope you've had fun uh, i'm back with you tomorrow this afternoon you are joined by the ridiculous fabulous talent of Laura Vining and the ridiculous, fabulous, wondrous human being that is Jenny Cleary. So you're going to have a great afternoon. I've been very, very, very honoured to be joined by Sammy. I'll be joined by Jan tomorrow, which I'm really excited about. We've got a textile-based show, which I've not really ventured into before, so I'm looking forward to that. But today, we've been joined by Sammy and... Oh, <laughs> praise me! And um, now then, Kim, have you got the ring there? And the earrings over there. Oh, the earrings are here. Hang on, hang on, hang on. <laughs> Um, Mike, can you please go and wrench <laughs> the ring off uh, Kim's finger, please, that we need to show? <gasps> that is just sublime, gorgeous. So we gave to Sammy at the start of the show three strands of genuine natural amethyst. Oh, it's just had a little bit of heat treatment. And uh, Sammy's challenge was basically do what you want with them. So with these gorgeous little drops, pop them on the end of the earrings. To say that you have, have a huge, ridiculous amount left is an understatement. Um, look at this. Look at that. <gasps> wow. Kim is just delighted to be owning that. It's the biggest understatement of the century. She loves it, she just said. And she says to say that she loves you. Oh, thank you. Love you too, Kim. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> uh, no, it's hugely appreciated. Um, and that is just, oh, it's stunning. It's just simple, but when you've got a beautiful stone like that, you don't need to do anything yeah. else. Um, that just says, look at me. It's all about the stone. Look at me. Look at me. And you know what? I think it looks more expensive because you've done less as well. Yeah. You haven't tried to overdo it. It's just there. Beautiful. And then this next one along which is you know if you if you don't particularly enjoy doing mm. wire then just do that and that it looks gorgeous as well I just show you the three strands that we gave to Sammy at the start of the show to give you a bit of a heads up once again they're only 49 14 49.95 would be <laughs> brilliant yeah 14.95 is insane and it's the truth <laughs> So, Sammy, when are you back with us? I'm back, you're back on Friday. Oh, doing, are you? Doing the DI on Friday, yes. Designer Inspiration show on Friday. I'm back with you tomorrow and I'll be with you on Saturday as well. So, if I don't get to see you tomorrow, if you can't see the show, Happy New Year and I'll see you in 2015. That's weird. Uh, if not, <laughs> I'll see you tomorrow. I'm hoping you're looking forward to it with a textile fabulous show. Thank you to my fabulous, fabulous team as always. Thank you, Thank you so much to Sammy. You're a joy Thank to work you. with. Thank you to you for watching. Don't go anywhere. Laura is up next with Jenny. Bye. Bye. Thank you.